Oh shit. Oh shoot. Hello. Hi. What do you mean oh shit? Uh, <laughs> Oh, I shit. said, oh my god, uh, I said food. Oh, my god. Oh, oh, food. Oh, food. Anyway, Hi. oh, wait. Belum ada big, belum oh, ada food. Mm. Oh, Bob. Uh, oh, hi, oh, everyone. Bob. Oh, hi. Hi, dear. What's going on from Niji? Yeah. My name is Reza Van Luna. Um, welcome back to Niji RPG. Uh, today, as uh, you know, usual, Hello. we're playing Nocturne of the Heaven, a Kamiya Kari campaign with my amazing regulars. Hi, everyone. Aww. Is that the thing? Aww. Is that the thing? Aww. I did say that. I mean, you guys are my amazing <laughs> yeah, friends slash regulars, but yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm a thing. The thing. The thing. Oh, God. <laughs> um, but yeah, um... Before we start, um, for everyone who don't know, uh, for everyone who doesn't know, this is uh, our bi-weekly um, campaign thing. Uh, Nocturne of the Heaven is a Kamigakari campaign. Uh, it's a TRPG from Japan that got um, translated Japan. into English by Serpent Sea yeah. Games. And yeah, you guys, should, you guys should check it out. It's it's so anime. Not gonna lie. It's so anime. Very, very, very. Uh, before we talk about Nocturne, let's talk about the elephant in the room. There's a let's huge gap up. there. Um, Lila is not here. Oh. It's banished! So we were talking to ourselves all this uh, time. <laughs> it was uh, not there's a little problem. bit of scheduling conflict and Lila will be joining us midway into the game today. So, um, there we go. And, um... For the rest, let's introduce everyone and, uh, you know, just introduce yourself and break with what their character. Uh, maybe uh, say a little bit of what they think after the second episode uh, last, uh, you know, two weeks ago. So, um, Zaya, please introduce yourself and your character. Hello, what's poppin'? I'm ah. Zio Cornelia, and uh, today, as always, I'll be playing as Kuraku. You know, she's, uh, I don't think she's okay. She's uh -huh. stuck with, like, the the craziest people. <laughs> For, yeah, you know, you know the, the group that goes to the north and faces health end of the game? That I think it's supposed to be, like, health and content of the game. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> right? Yeah, but, we, we, I mean, Kuraku does not face the health and content of the game, but she faces people that does not care whether in what part of the game they are in, you know? Oh, yeah. I mean, <laughs> I guess so, yeah. You know, okay, two more hours with these people, I think she's gonna snap, so wish her luck. Thank you, Zaya, <laughs> and um, a brief explanation about her character, Kuraku. Uh, next up, um, Hyuna, La Tiora. Please oh, introduce yourself right. and your character today. There's no Lily, right? Um, hi, my name's Hyona. I also go by Hyoners. Um, I'm eating ice cream today, so no takoyaki. Ice cream! Uh, ice yes, cream. ice cream. Um, as for what's going on with Sae, I mean, after mm, after what happened in the last session. <laughs> what happened to the Uchiha clan? <laughs> <laughs> After what happened in the last session, I wish I can give my ice cream to Sai. Oh my god, I guess so. Yeah. <laughs> because she certainly <laughs> needs it. Um, she's very um, anxious right now. There's some like old anxiousness that's kind of resurfacing back, uh -huh. you know? So, well, we'll, we'll see how she handle, handles it uh, handles it right now. Uh -huh. But yeah, she, she's not, she's not okay. Give her ice cream, please. Thank oh, you. Well. Uh, you know what? Let's, let's, you know, let's uh, hope Jack Frost opened Whoa, some uh, branches in Tsukimori. <laughs> look. Yeah? Oh, look. Oh my God. That's a lot of gifts. That's a lot. Oh, that's a lot. Thank you for the Let's gifted go. Uh, membership for everyone. And uh, for the 20 people, 20 lucky people of you. Um, Why get one? Welcome. Ah, damn, welcome to Tamfan Luna. Semoga kamu tetap hangat. You will Tamfan fold now. Yuck, yuck, yuck. Yeah? Yuck. Kalau di Sukumori ada lahan kosong jadi tempat es krim gak? Ya makanya. <laughs> bakal ada Jack Frost di Sukimori kayaknya. 
uh, dikit lagi saya kahika aja <laughs> jadi jadi <laughs> ekspres <laughs> Kahika jangan bangkrut ya Anto jadi tempat diskripsi Saya Kahika enggak kayaknya kayaknya oh um, oh ada pensil kayak <laughs> pensil ada aku <laughs> kayaknya oh uh, Murata yang bakal ini bakal bakal franchising uh, anyway <laughs> thank you uh, Hiona next up um, Nara please introduce oh. yourself and your character today oh yeah hello uh, <laughs> Hello guys, it's Nara here, and today I'll be playing as uh, Ono Kohane. Uh, what's up with her mind? I, well, she is conflicted, uh-huh. as in she still have moral. She cares about this kid who is kind of dead and then kind of alive again? Question mark. Uh-huh. Not sure alive or not. She knows her family and stuff, but she got a job on the line as well. And she's practically have no idea like if there is even a side going on or like which side she should go to. So she just probably plan to assess the situation and then decide from there. Also, her co-workers kind of dying, all of them kind of need to take care of that as well. So, yeah. I mean, yeah, but yeah. A lot of things to take care of, so... <laughs> Thank you very That's probably much. what's on her mind. Thank uh, you. Thank you, yeah. Nara. Uh, also, uh, welcome back to Tom Van Volt, Eruchi. Uh, yeah. Uh, next up, after Nara, uh, Takarajiman, please introduce yourself and your character. Good yeah. evening, everyone. My name is Takarajiman, and today I'm playing... Who the fuck is this name? Murata Kesi is Murata, right! Yeah. I'm playing Murata Cases in this campaign. Last time I've remembered anything about him, he was basically giving the middle finger to the detective guy because he did never pay for the cigarettes. The That's all. Who? Oh, the, the detective guy. Right. Uh, uh, you know, the, the boss. Oh my god, DM! The detective. <laughs> In my mind, it's like it's just police officer, and I was like, no, that other detective. Anyway, he's a he's a dick, right? Yeah, I mean, like dick as in detective. <laughs> yeah, hell yeah, he's a dick, don't you? Right? Yeah, yeah, hell yeah, dick as in detective. Uh, thank you, Taka. Um, last one. Uh, Rai Galilei, please. Um, you know, once again, answer the question to be cursed or to be. Ascend it. <laughs> Introduce yourself and your character. I cannot believe. Hi, it's a oh, me, Rai Galilei. Time. That haven't been streaming for a very long time. Uh... Isn't that like the nor- norms? Yeah, I mean that's just you. Guys, guys, kalian harus tahu tadi sebelum mulai stream dia tuh kayak benerin suara dulu sih Rai nih. Iya oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. dia kayak oh, gitu. <coughs> gitu. <laughs> gitu dah. Kamu tuh sangat 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 ekstrim gitu kayak. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> Wait, you you're a, stri- a streamer, I Galilei? I didn't know that. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh yes, I I am just your friend who tags along in a uh, Niji Sanji streamer. Okay, stream, continue yes. with your Godwin um <laughs> introduction. Uh, I will be playing as Godwin. Very nice. <laughs> I'm too shy to actually do his voice like right now. Uh, so man, I'm okay. not gonna do that. Nice, Jovanayo. Anyway, uh, nice to see you guys again. Yeah. 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 Uh, <laughs> welcome back to your bi-weekly anime, people. Uh, a little bit of heads up. Um, I'm sure, uh, you know, for especially for you guys, old Tom Fandunas. Uh, who already noticed, but um, Reza Faluna will sound a little bit like early Reza Faluna today because I'm low key. <laughs> low key! I'm just a little bit low key today. Uh, Not a little bit, it's by a lot. I'm sorry, Rob. By, so, by yeah. low key. I'm just by a little bit closer to the mic. And, um, you know, but yeah. Is this a rebranding? No, not rebranding. I'm just tired. Yeah. Today. Just sit there. What do you mean by rebranding? I mean, I'm just bored. No, 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 I'm just bored. You know, if you say you're rebranding, I would be a very supportive friend. Um, you know. And what, kind of you yeah. what kind of support would you provide? What kind of support? What kind of support? I would play along with your RP. <laughs> RP, yes. I'm definitely RPing. Uh, being, you know. <laughs> Uh, if you're planning to, if any of you guys plan to rebrand, I'm gonna play along with your RP, okay? So chill. I'm like a very professional oh. coworker. But uh, I I thank you so much for your existence, yeah. <laughs> thank you, thank you for being with me. Ooh. 
Not me. Anyway. You do right. <laughs> but you need to answer to be cursed or to be Oh my god. You need to answer to that. To be cursed. To answer. Or to I be ascended. Believe. But yeah, um we're going to we will we'll we're probably going to try to end uh, today's session a little bit early, so let's start um early too. Uh, I hope everyone is ready for today. <laughs> no, never ready. Uh, I would say no, but okay. My stomach was not ready, but let's go. I hope you guys are ever ready. Uh, let's uh, get that thing out. HP gua. Huh? Abelo, yeah, <laughs> you're, you're still 69, man. I know. It's going to be over soon. HP gua. HP gua. HP lu 69. Iya. Terus ini kan HP GW, kan? Got win, kan? Yeah, 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 got win. GW. Ah, Choto sa, ah, are ka. As we start today's session, I'm sorry everyone, but we're going to start with... Hi, Yukimura-sai. <laughs> uh, well, <laughs> this is going to be, uh, I don't know. Holy, fun. I'm so sorry about it. Wait, wait, not this one. I apologize. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> 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 dun, dun, dun. Okay. You made me open my notebook. I was scared. <laughs> why? Why? Why do you want to open your notebook? To take notes. Okay, I know which one. Okay. Um, I hope everyone is ready. So, um, Kamigagari campaign, Nocturne of the Heaven, Episode Three. It's going to start shortly for everyone and for the audience. Good luck and have fun. <sighs> you know, it's, um, it's been almost two weeks at least. It's 10 days or around 10 days since the incident. In the concert that time, things have died down a little. You've um, at least everything is back to its fairly peaceful day, even though there's a lot of things in your mind or in anyone, everyone's mind. Today, it's a Thursday, where you usually do your monthly grocery shopping, and it got a little bit late, so you're just walking through the alleys and the, the residential road, not that far from Himawari House, the place that you're working in. It's quiet, it's peaceful, but of course, every time your gaze wanders a little bit to the, the sky, you can still see it. The cracked sky, or that huge gap, and a single eye staring into the world. One thing that you know for sure is that the one that is not an awakened can see it. But even the children in, even some children in Himawari house, Rentaro being one of them, oh dear, can see the eye of an angel or at least that's what a lot of people that you 
no can see it. Call it. It's been a while, so your mind is already... You know, starts to forget about the tragedy. But at least you know that Hoshino Sera is perfectly fine. She just visited two days ago. And actually is just living her life. Normally. Oh, thank God. <laughs> You're walking down that street. But. Around 11 p.m. 30 minutes before you reach Himawari house. You hear a scream of a man. Ah! Not that far from where you are. Oh, dear. <laughs> <laughs> I got children to feed! Oh my god. I know. Um, uh, uh, am I able one thing to... before you do anything, one thing that you know hmm. about the things around that, that's that's happening for the past, you know, uh, 10 days is that, well, despite everything being a little bit peaceful, but within 10 days, you. They, there are at least two reports in the news of. A body being found in an alley. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think I think Sai very peaceful. I think Sai, you know, she's still like trotting her like grocery bags in her arms. I know. And she's gonna uh -huh. like stop. And then she's really gonna contemplate between like whatever that direction of the scream is coming from. Yeah. And like and then like where the direction of Himawari home is, and she's gonna like <laughs> glance between the two of them like uh <laughs> Is she is she able to decipher how far the scream is from her? Um I'd say it's um you know ex immediately i think it's you know it's it's the 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 area the general area is technically between you and where himawari house is but like just a little bit closer than you it's like the scream is not that you know loud but you can mm. hear it like a little bit close it's probably just right up the next alley on to your right you know, you, you know, like, you know the resident area really well because, you know, you've, you've spent th um, the past five years, you know, looking for children who are walking, uh, who are, like, running away probably or, like, when they're missing or not or, like, you know, just mm -hmm. just interacting with the, the neighborhood. So, mm. um, you know exactly where it is, but that, that alley is, like, it's not exactly a dead end, but, like, it is a small alley, like, around uh, this yeah. residential, residential area. Um, well, she at first is seriously considering just going straight to the orphanage because she's got frozen chicken nuggets. Uh-huh. But at the same time, she's also thinking, you know, with the recent news, if there's anything actually dangerous patrolling around, it'd be bad if it does come to the children. So uh -huh. she, she sighs and then she finally just looks at the direction of the scream and she mutters to herself like just, just please make this quick mm -hmm. and she starts walking to it like uh -huh. really tightly holding her grocery bag mm -hmm. sure you ran there and Immediately, what you see, uh, what, what you see at probably like the center, the middle of that alley, it's like long, it's, it's not that long, but like it's long enough to at least be a little bit darker midway. There's not exactly a, a straight light to light up, to mm -hmm. light up the whole thing, the whole thing, but you can see a silhouette of two individuals. Oh. One is 
literally sitting on the floor, sitting on the ground, scared, like you know, like trying trying to crawl their way back while 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 sitting, and the other one is this tall, long hair silhouette that from the silhouette itself you can see that it's holding. A huge scissor. Ah. Huge pair of scissors. Naruhoto. Naruhoto. <sighs> um. Do any of those pair notice uh, Sai coming? Not yet. But mm. but they can hear like the guy is like, help, help, you, you, please, please, whoever you are at the end of the alley, please help. You can hear that 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 um you know, voice coming uh, from there. Uh well, Sae will very gently put down her grocery bag somewhere that's not wet uh -huh. on the ground, and she's going to approach the tall, long-haired lady who's. You know, holding a scissor. Sure. You you walk closer. As your eyes, your pupils adjust to the low light of that place. You know, the, the, the details around that alley start to get a little bit clearer. And clearer. And as it stops, you know... As it hear the the man calling out whoever at the end of that alley, is like that that silhouette who's standing tall. Mm -hmm. So to turn around, I want you to please roll. Mm. Sorry, I, f I, I forgot the terminology for that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I want you to please roll. And because this is the first roll, I want everyone to roll their spirit pool first. Okay. Oh, yeah. I forgot about that. It's okay. I mean, we oh, forgot about it. So. Yeah, so all four. Please roll all four of your spirit pool. Oh shit! 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 Or mm -hmm. luck for sense maneuver. Yep, I up think to you. I'll go with luck for now. Sure. Uh, Submit it, please. That will be 13. 13 is actually enough. Ooh. You see, like, from the details, from the details that you can see. First of all, just from the silhouette of the clothing and how it stands, how the overall look of this creature, human, mm -hmm. is. You feel a little bit of fam uh, familiarity. But the closer you get, the more detailed of a face you see. And standing there with long hair, but I can see clearly behind this ripped mask, the mask, you know, the, the surgical mask, is mm -hmm. this huge grin of slit mouth, like of a slit mouth. It's that Kuchisake Onna that you fought <sighs> 10 days ago. You. Put Shiraishi Maria in your bond. Ay, yes, sir. And that lady just says, Oh, Miss, let me ask you a question. Do I look 
beautiful. Sai just stares at her and then looks at the man cowering on the ground. Uh-huh. And then back at, uh, what's her name again? Maria again. Uh-huh. Well, I guess you do, but well, that depends on what you're planning to do with this man here. She's just staring at you. As I say that, you get closer to this lady. And the moment probably when, when probably you're just five, six meters ish from her, you can see that she starts to notice who you are, uh. and like her eyes are so widened, and you can see like her slit mouth because like it's you know it's it's far bigger than normal human mouth. So it's clear as it trembles a little bit. Looks like she remembered you, and she immediately just take a few steps back away and poof, 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 runs away. Oh, well, uh, uh, all right. Um, I'm going to like first. I'm going to sigh, like thinking, like, well, thank God I didn't have to pull out my weapon, and. She's going to crouch down to the man mm -hmm. and just like, sir, sir, are you, uh, are you okay? Did she, did she hurt you? Are you injured? You crouch down to the guy and this man is a, is a man around 160 around to 175 centimeters tall. He has this black hair, just plain black hair. And he wearing these glasses. You see this guy? Just a normal dude. Hmm. And he's like, <laughs> oh, th thank you about that. Um, I didn't know what will happen to me if you didn't show up. And then he stands up. You see, like... <clears throat> And just because you rolled the uh, sense, uh, the 13 on sense before. Mm. You see this guy, despite what, what you just saw happened, there's no actual injury on his body mm. at all. Mm. He's like, <sighs> oh, thank you about that, really. Um. Yes, well, um, it's, uh, well, I'm sure you've seen the news. It's been kind of dangerous around here. So, uh, do get home quickly. If you're not injured, oh, then I'm... Well, what kind of news? I'm, I'm kind of just visiting around here. So I, I don't know what actually has happening or any news going on. Oh, um, well... Uh, I don't really know the details of it, but they say that there's been a few bodies been found around these areas. Lately, bodies? So. Yes. Um, I... Oh, I, I see. Yes. yes. So, going out in the middle of the night is a bit um dangerous. Unwise. So. I understand that, at least, I guess. Right. Sai, Sai is starting to feel a bit weirded out by this guy, so she just like steps a little bit back like, All right, um, I, you take care then. I'm just gonna go. Um, please be careful. Well, of course, of, of course, yes, miss. Um, can I ask you a question? Um, at this point, Sai is already turning her back to him, but she kind of just like glances back again, like, um, I, I, I suppose. What What's is it? With the eye. The 
The what? Never mind. Never mind. I'll take care for the night, and then he walks away. s a i s a bit like flabbergasted, and she just keeps staring at the man walking away. <laughs> But then she turns back and grabs her groceries from the ground and just like walks home, mm-hmm. <laughs> still still you, thinking about the well, man. You're, you're you're staring a little bit at the man as they walk away. You can see like the last thing, the last detail you notice as he walked away is like he's walking with a limp. Mm-hmm. Oh dear! And just as he disappears into the dark of the night. And and scene. Thank you, Sai. Yeah. Before I continue to the title drop, I will introduce uh, mechanics for everyone. There's something yeah. that is called an appearance check. So every start of the scene, I will. Um, You know, as usual, the scenes will have specific players for that for them. But if you uh, if you want to appear in that particular scene, you can do an appearance check, and I will just tell you what to roll and who is allowed to roll for that. But yes, mm. 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 episode mm. three, Mister mm. Blue Sky. Morning, morning, good suki morning, everybody. It's your buddy Danish. What a beautiful Monday! How's your weekend? I had a really good one because my boss decided to go on a business trip. Isn't that nice? Oh right, a scary story this week. Another body of a woman is apparently found in the corner of the market district. That's two in two weeks, man. Shivers. Be careful on your way to work and be. Listening to the radio in the morning of that day, it's been now two weeks since the incident of the the concert. We open our um, scene in the Fleur de Lune High School, private um, girls' high school. Quite a prestigious school within the Sukimori City. As we closing in to the principal office, a lady who is supposedly in her what the heck? I didn't put it in the whole thing. Oh my god, I forgot about it. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, wait, what? <laughs> I, didn't, I, didn't, I didn't have the image for that. Okay, fine. Uh oh. As it closed into the principal office, um, beautiful lady who is supposedly in her um, mid forties is sitting down behind a desk as she tur- as she turn off um, the morning read the morning radio and she just stumps a little bit. Oh, it's that annoying guy again. Is the DJ this morning? Huh. Um, we see the headmaster. Of Fleur de Lune School, Komorebi, Komorebi Suzu. She finished her um, cigarette and just put it off. Opened the uh, and then like opened the window a little bit. She snapped her finger and like just this mysterious gaze, uh, mysterious gust of wind just <laughs> blow like the the smoke and the smell away from like from inside. She closed the door. The door of that, uh, and she closed the window, and then the, the door of that um, principal office is knocked, and a voice can be heard from outside. Ma'am, they are here. Oh, right. Let them in. And the door opens. Walking into that. Principal office are two students. One is the the school's Takaninohana, 
Hoshino Sera. And the other one is the sole member of the occult club. Okay. Okay. And I was like, okay. The sole member of the occult club, Sayo Kurako, and Kurako. Uh, the moment the door is uh, opened by, you know, the principal's uh, assistant, you see the principal, um, Komorebi Suzu, Miss uh, Komorebi Suzu, sitting behind her huge desk in the middle. She looks a little bit concerned the moment she noticed the two of you. And she... Um, squinted a little bit, and she asked, "Is isn't there supposed to be three of you? Where where's Miss Hexenmeister?" Uh, um, uh, so Kurako looked at Hoshino Sera, waiting for her to reply. <laughs> 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 and um, Hoshino just said, "Uh." I believe Miss Hexenmeister was is is a little bit held in the music class. She she said she will come here later if it's all right, ma'am. And um, Miss Komorebi is just it's perfectly all right. Please come in, it's Sophia. Yes, um, uh, Kurako took one step inside the room. Uh-huh. That's all. Sure. And just please sit down, Miss Sayo. And like you see, uh, Hoshino Sera is already sitting down on this, you know, sofa. Okay, so h how many sofa are there? <laughs> okay, so uh, what you see inside, like, this is why I need the picture. Uh, <laughs> what you <laughs> see inside is this, um, first of all, there's this uh, huge table, huge desk, of course, um, in front of, like, this glass uh, wall that's looking towards the the um, front yard of Fleur de Lune. But also there's this coffee table and in front of it there's a few sofa and there's this one long one and just one single couch and uh, the other one on the other side. But yeah. Um, come uh, yeah she's these. going to sit on the one couch. Uh, sure, of course. You sit down there and um, Hoshino uh, Sarah just sat down and you know, awkwardly on one of the logs of us, like, alone. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Sarah. Like, noticing your behavior, it's like, what happens, like, uh, Suzu, Suzu is like, well, like, you can see, like, she shrugs a little bit, you know? And then she sat down on one of, like, this, the single couch again, like, you know, is now facing at the two of you. Uh, facing the two of you, yeah, sure. What a peculiar group. You guys are, including Miss Hexenmeister. It's. I didn't know there will be a time. I didn't ex expect that there will be a time where I call all three of you together into this room. But here we are. Um, now. Uh, yes, Miss Sahio. It's just, uh, I don't, I don't think, uh, I think you're calling the wrong person, Miss Komorebi. <laughs> she smiles. I know that you're going to say that, but I'm sure I called the right people. And as she turns a little bit towards the huge glass wall and looks outside, you can see like she's clearly trying to point at the... <laughs> Huge crack on the sky. And a huge crack in the sky with the eye looking down on the, you know, on the town. She pointed at that if it's not clear enough. And. Right? And then she just looks at you again, Kurako. No? 
what are you talking about, Miss Komorebi? Uh, are you are you healthy? But you can see Kuraku's eyes just starts all over the room <laughs> like a frantic person. <laughs> she then just says, "I want the two of you to please explain what happened in the Asteria concert." The, as as she said, Asteria. She looks at Sarah, who immediately offers her gaze to. <laughs> <laughs> and then looks at you again, like, and then looks at you, um, Kurako, and and explain a little bit of interaction with the Mononoke's there. Uh, I mean, uh, <clears throat> I just, um, I, I frequent the, the internet a lot, and, uh, well, I I heard of of the the concert and I I came. It's as as simple as that. I don't know anything about no 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 okay. right right. Sarah huh? Sarah was like uh, yeah yeah um yes. <laughs> she she just she, well she looks like she's not exactly a good liar. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. At least she's worse than you. <laughs> I <see. laughs> Um, she, Suzu, then, this will be so much better if Miss Axenmeister is here than your event. The event that happened two weeks ago. Shows maybe that there's something that I hid from all of you. Well, including all the students, but it is for your own safety. Outside of just being the private high school that it is, most girls that I admit to this place have some, I'd say, experience with the spiritual. Events. What? I mean, <clears throat> uh, uh, um, I, I still think you called on the wrong person, Miss Komorebi. Of course. Of course, that will be the thing that you say to me, but. The three of you, including Miss Hexenmeister, who, was, who is not here right now, have been in our watch list for a while. But, but I, I'm not a criminal, Miss. Please, I've never done anything wrong in my life. Not as a criminal. <laughs> Miss Kurako, please. Miss Saigo, please. Oh. Not as criminals, but as ones that need to be protected. Oh, I I don't feel protected. <laughs> you guys are of well, after all, my cute students. And as a principal, I need to Protect each and every one of you. Uh, in, I, I'm, I'm sorry. Well, well, I'm sorry. And then Kurako stood up from her chair and darted ar around the room, just like walking real fast. You know, mm -hmm. people who are, some people think like that. Kurako does too. And while darting around, she kept on, say, asking stuff like. Okay, so I would assume that you know everything about the Mononoke and what happened last night and uh, with the whole thing uh, and, and, and Hoshino saw over there that she's she uh, I, I saw her I saw her die and uh, Miss Hex and my sister was there and uh, I assume you all also know about that but like I don't I don't actually know what's happening at all and there's like this crazy bunch and I, the, the, oh, I I don't... I don't... Like a 
as you keep on rambling and you do that pause a little bit, you can see that she's just smiling at you kindly, um, caring, and she just say, "Are you done?" Well, not quite, but I I think if you called us here, then you you might have already known what's happening. But I still don't understand why you would call me here, cause I don't want anything to do with any of them. I swear, I just I just want to live. I understand, Kurako, and that is why I called all of you here. You see, the one thing that you need to understand, the target of whatever this is going on that I'm still looking at, the target for this is not just, well, the angel when she looks at Toshino Zera. There's a reason why you and Miss Hexen Meister were also lured, were also brought there, but whatever, by whatever brought you there. It is something that we're still investigating. And this is why I need the three of you to stick together. Huh? Stick, stick together with the high risk of Hexenmeister and Ochino oh, oh, with your schoolmates. With the iris of Hexenmeister and <clears throat> Hoshino Serasa. I just said I was like, with the iris of Hexenmeister um, and Kurakos and, and Sayosa? She's the surprise. You. See, even she is surprised. I mean, I know I'm just like, oh, what a cockroach in her eyes. But like, you know, I try to, I try to play safe. I lay low. Oh, in, no, in no, no, that that is not what I meant. But I just feel like I will intrude your personal space if anything. I. I... Oh, don't don't you mean the other way around? Like uh, me I intruding your personal space? Oh, well, of Ms. course Hoshino. not. I, but but you are. <laughs> and then Suzu so was like, <laughs> the two of you. But in the end, the two of you will be needed to intrude each other private space. Because I need. And then she looks at Kurako. I need. Hoshino and Hexen and Miss Hexen Meister to join your club. Sayosan. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Uh, I am not currently joined in any other clubs other than the Occult Club, Miss. I am currently not in any other clubs besides the, the Occult Club, miss. Well, then the Occult Club will have two additional members. <gasps> I hope you don't mind, but this is for the protection. Because you need to have each other's back. mind at all if if miss hexenmeister and of course miss hoshino doesn't mind uh, i mean you know since uh, since everyone in this room i mean the, you know you yourself included miss principal we you know we kind of you know know and are a little bit more involved in the occult so i i, I guess i guess you know it, it makes sense that we're in the occult club And I hope you don't mind, Hoshino. And Sarah was like, Yes, I don't mind if Sayo-san don't mind. Then it's... You can see Kurako giggling. 
Of course. <laughs> you just, very, I'm sure very, you're just happy scary, that they, you have yeah. like... A very scary <laughs> giggle that is non-stop. It's just... <laughs> <laughs> she she sends... Um, Suzu then sends up then. Then... You're dismissed. Hashino-san. But... Kurako, I need you to still be here. <laughs> what? Yes. Oh. Yes, ma'am. And Hoshino oh. just walked out. Yeah. Uh, Hoshino-san! Uh, yes. Um, see, see you after school? Of course. I will. I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> Oh my god, the Yandere Kuraku is back. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, the Yandere right? Kuraku from Manga This is funny, I like it. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and then, um, Komoro, Komorebi looks at you, Kuraku, and say, Now, Kuraku. Yes. I need to talk. I I need you to sit back down, first. Oh oh uh, yes, but but of course. And now she sits she sits on the long couch because there's nobody else on the sure. long couch. She what? <laughs> now you can feel like the the atmosphere around um, Komorebi is a little bit dull, serious. Damn. And she said. We need to talk about what lies inside you right now. Well, or at least who it is. How much do you know? Um, I... By, by what you mean with what I know is like... Um... Uh, what the, the people that was with me yesterday... Or... The lady. The Who's been lady? affecting your activities as of late. Uh, oh. Oh. You mean. Uh, in Angelica? Yes. I. Uh, I. 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 Uh, <clears throat> she fiddles with her hands, thinking, uh, you, uh, you, you can see that the, the couch is uh, rocking a little mm -hmm. as she rocks her body along. She, it, uh -huh. she stands up and... How long have you been a Kamigakari? How long has she been <gasps> with you? Um, I guess it's been, what, uh, f four years? Four. Well, I knew that you do have that kind of connection to the spirits. I didn't expect that it's been so long. Well, I didn't. I didn't expect I would um, stay alive this long. To be honest. She walks to the window and looks outside. She, she you, you can see that she's staring at the, the eye in the sky and she said, Do you know the Crimson Chamber? Ah, uh, the, the Crimson Chamber? What's your int- <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> I'm going to ask that question. What's your intellect score? <laughs> Oh, oh, uh, uh, my intellect score oh, is shit, actually, actually <laughs> six. Hmm? Uh, six. It's not minus one anymore, oh my god. It's six. I have all over again. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, oh, my god. My oh my god. Let's go. I can't, I can't believe that I asked um, Zia Cornelia that fun. question again. Um, I can't believe I want, that it's me. I want you to roll, um... Intellect for recall. Maneuver. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Intellecto. 
It's it's not that hard. It won't be that hard. Thirteen. Ooh. Do you want to influence, or are you just going to keep that? Uh, sure. I'm gonna influence. Oh. Uh, let me see what I have. Oh, I you're have just, three per five. You're uh, just, I'm just, you're gonna, just going to take yeah. the six, huh? <laughs> uh, no, I'm gonna reply. I mean, I mean, I'm gonna replace the one with my five. Sure. Then you put five in and take the one out. Um. Well, you remember like a lot of things about it. You've been in Kamigaku for four years, and you've been, you know, um, you've been scrolling through, like, lurking through the Pathfinder for as long as you can remember. <laughs> <laughs> that's yeah, probably yeah, what you do right. what you've been doing since you're five or something browsing 4chan uh, yeah. <laughs> I mean Pathfinder you know before that like the thing before before Pathfinder maybe there's something else you know like the old YouTube uh, <laughs> um, your space <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, what's it called? Um, Tomoda Chister. Yeah. Stop, Avan Luna. The, 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 the children will not understand. You <laughs> uh, know, while you're listening to music from your lemon wire. Uh, anyway, <laughs> let's not talk about that. Um, the Crimson Chamber is basically this group of Aramitama of really high level, you know, really strong Aramitama who are Ooh. basically feared by all the awakens within Sukimori. Well, by all I meant all Mononokes and all other Aramitama. Maybe a few awakens, maybe like a a, par, um, a few percent of the awakens, but uh, away of kamigakari, but like some kamigakari like you don't exactly know or have not encountered the crimson chamber. But I've heard of it, yes. Um. You just encounter like the. Rumors about that, but I don't think you've ever encountered well before, you know. Yeah. And um, Komore Bijasei. Your friend there. Friend, um, friend, uh, who Angelica. are you? Ah, uh, oh, well, I wouldn't call her a friend, but <sighs> she has a close connection to the current leader of the Crimson Chamber. Oh, an Aramitama oh. called Amanojaku. Ha, oh. ha. Oh. Uh, what I mean, I, I wow, that that's new to me. I mean, Angelica never actually really talked to me or anything. It's just basically, you know, like a parasite. You can't really hear them. Well, and whatever his plan is now, definitely shows that. You and your ability have some connection with the angel. And that is something that I need you to be aware of. Because whatever um, is going on in Tsukimori right now is going to be dangerous. For you and well, everyone around. Miss, I think I think I already kind of grasped that since since the day I got this weird I wouldn't call it power, then a um, parasite in me and well, since 
yesterday. Um, I, I don't understand anything. I, I really don't. It's just, it, it, I feel like everybody else knows something that I don't. And I'm just stuck in the middle. I'm in the eye of the storm, but not really. Actually, they are the, I, I don't know. I'm in the storm. I'm probably flying around and I'm going to fall down to my death onto the ground. What I call? Yes. It's always like that. And that's no. why I'm here. That's why the teachers are here. And that's why the adults are around for you to lean on. Oh, but she remembered about the adults she saw yesterday and she just she just <laughs> two weeks uh, ago, she just did. Not yesterday. Oh yeah, yeah two, two weeks, weeks ago, ago. Two weeks ago. And she just she just, you know, she just uh galang -galang. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> the creepy old man, the other creepy old man. <laughs> <laughs> the the creepy siscon. Oh my god. Um but anyway she just said it all. I hope you can feel at ease with friends around you. Now go back to class. Wait, I... You, you, you don't actually expect me to just be able to study like normal, right? Because... I will make sure that at least within the grounds of Lure de Lune... You are protected. Oh. Uh, oh. Uh, really? Yes. Oh, for real, for real. Okay, lol. That, that makes it so much better. Thank, thank you, Miss Komorebi. <laughs> she nods. I go back to class? Question mark, question then mark. Then you left. The place. <gasps> meanwhile, <laughs> I like this. Like meanwhile, meanwhile, meanwhile. Yes, thank you for saying that because it is your yeah. turn. Hi, Godwin. <laughs> what? <laughs> <the hell? laughs> Mampus <laughs> kau. <laughs> <laughs> Um, you know, I just in the other side, in, in the other corner of the town, walking slowly through the corridors in the underground level of the police department is this suave <laughs> old man that is Godwin. Hi. Hey. <laughs> Well, middle age man. Uh, uh, are you, I, I are you experiencing your midlife crisis right now? Uh, <laughs> I guess uh, my my hair is white now, so. <laughs> is it? Is it? <laughs> Walking slowly, the two. Oh my god, this music too. That. Wait, why? Why? Why is it this one? <laughs> I'm sorry. Bro, I, like... I didn't know that was going to be a little bit of 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 a Walking through, <laughs> for you, okay. Walking through that corridor, that dark. It was like, well, not exactly well lit corridor, even though it's in the middle of like the day. Um, you are walking towards the morgue of um the four four the division four 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 of, well, Sukimori Police Department. You are called here, or at least we're notified that. There's some interesting specimen that you will that that you're probably interested in. Of course, by the insider, 
of um, the division, the the one that you know as the the younger brother of the Hexenmeister CEO. Brother? Yeah, the younger brother. You know this guy, Yuki Hexenmeister. Oh, Yuki! Yuki is a boy. <laughs> You is a boy. It's a boy. Ah, walking in, you see just this, you know, frail um, dude, frail like you know, a uh, forensic doctor. He has like this uh, short hair, a little bit uh, dark, uh, wearing like just this um, gla- pair of glasses, uh, of which like one side is, you know, taped. It's a, and uh. He's just wearing, you know, the usual uh, lap coat and... Dr. Godwin, you're here! Ah, Yuki. I have heard you have called for me. What is wrong? Well, well, well. I have a really good specimen for you and, um... As usual. Ah, very good job as usual, Yuki. Is it still fresh? Crash from the fridge? <laughs> it's not exactly mm. sure. I mean, you know, <laughs> we need to keep the corpse fresh by free. You know what? It's does it doesn't exactly matter, right? I guess it does matter, but only a little bit. I'll let that slide. <laughs> Johannes. He calls it's not really, by the way. <laughs> Oh, no, oh, Johannes. shit. Uh, okay, uh, I, I retract that, Johannes. <laughs> I retract that. I didn't say that okay. Johannes is with you. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. <laughs> Can I roll for no, that? More like, are you the type to bring your hand into this, please? Uh, all right. Uh, what? Are you the type to bring your hand fa- fast into this place? Uh, I, I I think I, I tend to bring your hand to do the the like, as it called moving work, the thing that makes ah, him like you know. Okay. Then he's there. It's up there. Okay. Okay. I good. Mean, good. Okay. Okay. So I call your hand. <laughs> okay. And like and it's like yes, doctor. Please do check the body and okay. make sure that it's uh, at least have most of it intact. Oh, well, of course. And he looks excited and he walks towards like this um, corpse that is, you know, like, um, what is it? Uh, covered by just this um, blanket. You know, like, I hope you don't mind, Dr. X and Meister. And Yuki just, oh, do your thing. I don't know. There's a reason why I called it so over here. And um, Foss just immediately like, revealed the body. What you see is a body of um of a young woman. Probably Ooh. around late teenage year, 17 to 19 years old. Has this long black hair braided. Um It's cut. Here and there. In a lot of places. There's a lot of like cut wounds here and there. But the one thing that he, that that piqued your interest, at least, is that every single cut that is on her body are actually stitched back. And uh, Yuki just said, Isn't this weird? I mean, I didn't stitch them up. It came like this. Hmm... Okay, can I can I can I check if the cut is a scissor wound? I let you roll. <laughs> oh, what? Roll what? Um, I let you roll. Uh, a praise. So intellect check. Are you an arcane user? I believe your 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 class is arcane. Uh, is it? I don't think I'm arcane. I don't think I is don't it, think I have it, class. Is it skill? I'm no, a... it's like your your f- facet. Uh... What's your what's the type? Martial, skilled, or arcane? Ma- martial, martial, martial. Mar- oh my god, you're a martial. 
<laughs> then just an intellect roll. <laughs> then just an intellect roll. Ah, but by the power of primitive memories, know, my intellect check like... is always a success. <laughs> and then he will always succeed on that God. if you use that talent. Well, with, will... with, with, the, with the cost of even dice, I will change one of my dice. <laughs> I will use God. one of my six dice spirit pool and change it into five. <laughs> and then... That's it. And then you immediately succeed, right? I immediately succeed. Yes. The strength check. <sighs> I forgot about <laughs> that. Um, so, well, you're investigating through the whole thing because you know, like, your prowess in combat and everything. The cut itself is not exactly from... Well, there, there are differences between um, the Caesar wounds and the Caesar of like I, I, I understand like which one you're actually referring to, mm -hmm. but it's just a little bit weird because like Caesar wounds will definitely have um, you know just just normal Caesar will probably have like double, you know, double side cut, double side cut thing. or anything, um, but. If you remember that other scissor, it will act more like a sword, like a huge, like a long sword. So the cut uh. is definitely going to be bigger. But like all these cuts are definitely mm, clean, and they're like they're clean. Like all the cuts around, like the body is uh, is definitely clean, are definitely clean, and um, it it doesn't match. Either a small scissor, like a normal scissor, or a huge pair of scissors, it it match something more like um, an exacto knife. Exacto knife. Exactly. Like the small, like the small knife. Yeah, yeah that's small you... knife or you know, gunpla thingy. Uh, stuff like plastic model and everything, like for crafting mm. and all. Um, and from that too, you can see that. First of all, the cut is made um, after like you, you're a doctor. <laughs> you're a, yeah. you're you're a <laughs> you're a smart doctor, even though you're not exactly an arcane user. Um, hey, <laughs> <laughs> I'm still a doctor, you know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> you um, you have deduce that at least the cut was made after the corp uh, the the person is killed and then got stitched back and um knowing that you notice all of those accent Meister Yuki was just isn't that interesting I mean, I'm very excited to meet the one who did this. I see. I I am indeed interested. But yeah, I mean, I'm sure this? there will be pretty, or or that's what the legends say, right? Uh, can I recall? <laughs> like what? What is trying to say? Uh, well, you can ask him. <laughs> 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 okay, I, I'm gonna ask. Well, what by the pronoun you games, he doesn't. You don't don't exactly understand, but you can ask him. Yeah. What do you mean by pretty? I mean, you know, like from what I heard. I mean, especially because like the previous body that was found probably a week ago, um, was also like this, a beautiful woman cut up and stitch up you know haven't you heard of, the, of a, a kuchisake on the I mean you know is it kuchisake on the hmm. I don't know but I heard all kuchisake on the are pretty well all the women, all, all, all of this are women, so I, w I understand if Kuchisake Ona is probably one of the suspects. Mm -hmm. Well, let me know if there's anything about this suspect of ours. It could also be a pervert, you know. 
I prefer to cut girls up and stitch them all back. You're right. Hmm. Well, you know, you just, you're free to take the corpse. I already messed up with all of the paperwork as usual. You know, the dirty works, and then you're free to take it. And then he walks away. Um, one other thing that you realize is that despite everything not being spiritual or like any have, having any you know spiritual aura around it but the threads that are used um for the uh the stitches you can feel like those are not exactly normal threads they do feel a little bit mystic ah Something that I cannot deduce. Interesting. <laughs> well, at least you know, as a, as a kamigaka, you you know that. Oh, okay. You can you do um, feel like the the uh, the faint trace of like the spirit batter or anything like that? Johannes. Uh, yes, doctor. Bring the body back to the lab. Mayhaps I want to take a small stroll in the town. Of course, Doctor. And so he walks away. Sure. <laughs> Leaving Johannes with the body. You walked away. I walked away. The last thing <laughs> you'd notice as you walk away you can sense like this really faint existence of the thread. Just moving from that body. Like moving through the corridor, like out, and basically creating like this track toward whatever it is in the middle of uh, whatever it is at the other end of that thread. Can you feel that? Well, you can see that at least, but you uh, can, I can see, see like no one else noticed that. Okay. So, so he was actually following the tracks. <laughs> Convenient. <laughs> Convenience, yes. Convenience. I love it. Um, well, thank you, Godwin. <laughs> As we move on to the next scene. The next scene for the player is Murata Keshi. Hi, Murata. But um, Kohane and Sai, if the two of you want to appear in the scene, you may roll a luck check with the difficulty 12. If you want. Huh. If you don't want to, then... Like, do we decide it before the scene or after? Yes, before the scene. <laughs> and we get, we get no details where the scene yeah. is. Yeah. Uh, That's the thing. It will take place in Sakahika. Oh, hey, 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 Kohane, wanna do some shopping? <laughs> Let's do some shopping. If our luck, if our luck, bless us, do some shopping. All right, let's see, let's see if our luck bless us. God, we want okay. to shop. What, what? No, 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 no. Luck no, check. No, no, no. Luck check with the difficulty 12. Let's see. Let's see if she got shopping. To, to yeah. appear in the scene. I go oh shopping. I, 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 I want to. Why we go no, no, shopping? No, you can't. Only, only Kohan and Sai. Jadi, apa? Jadi, laksak itu laksak. Hah? Laksak itu laksak, Jadi, ya? Oh, damn. Oh, laksak itu laksak. Enggak, 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 enggak. Oh, oh ya, bukan, Kak. Enggak, Jai Boy, enggak. 15 and 16, oke. Okay. Um, I hope you guys shopping. feel uh, lucky today. No. <laughs> As we go to Sekahika, just this small place, this small, uh, what is it, small store in the middle of the uh, shopping district of Tsukimori. Um, that will soon be Jack Frost. <laughs> <laughs> I will not let that happen. Oh my god. I know it will, I will, I know it will not happen, yes. Um, Murata. You You're just uh sitting there 
Okay, first of all, are you a type to... Are you a type to read the newspaper, Morata? Yes. And crossword, if, if you forget. Of course, yeah. Like, you're, you're definitely doing the crossroads be uh, besides, like, the comics, you know? <laughs> the, crossroads? The, 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 the Please don't do the crossroads. crosswords Please don't I do mean, the co crossroads. Crosswords <laughs> beside, like, you know, the, the four panels comics. Siapa sih namanya itu yang di itu? Kepala gue tau. Itu yang dulu itu. Um, anyway. Yeah. Um... Reading the thing, reading the newspaper, um, one of the front line is um, basically this huge title. Two bodies have been found for the past 10 days for assault reports. Um, there's, a, there, there, there's a lot of things going on, but um, one thing that, for, that is for sure that's like being talked about within, uh, in the newspaper is... Well, the the two mysterious corpses of, you know, women. Um, but one thing that you know from the news is that the two bodies were found in the same exact um, condition. And uh, the police have been... Uh, well, the police have not... Um, haven't given any statement about it. But a lot of um, journalists are speculating about the possibility of um, a serial killer on the loose. Hmm. At this point, uh, <sighs> there's a knock on the door. Uh, excuse me. Ah, uh, yes. How, how can I help you? Welcome to Sekaika, anyway. If you haven't read the signs? Well, at least now I know that you're the owner of the Kahika. And uh, you see from, well, the the two weeks ago, you see this guy. Uh, you know him from the, whatever happened two weeks ago in downtown. Uh, it's Tachibana Satoru, part of the detective agency. Oh, I know you. You're the... You're the la you're, you're the dick slap dogs. I would like to think that I'm not, but I understand resentment towards our boss. He's missing by the way, but I'm sure you don't exactly need to know that. Oh, have you read the newspaper? It says here a body has been discovered! Right in the head, uh, headlines, like, geez, this this neighborhood is scary, isn't it? He smiles. Well, two bodies, to be exact, and four assault cases, and that's actually the reason why I came here. Uh, you, you, you think I have something to do with the bodies? Not the bodies, but the assault cases on four people. The what? Here's the thing. He, he walks to you. All four victims are male. Yes, I can see from the news. Around a hundred. 65 to 175 centimeters tall, black hair, wearing glasses. Oh, just like the CEO. I don't know if you know that guy. Oh, I cannot believe you did that. Like what? <laughs> and then he just said, All are attacked by someone who, before attacking, said, Am I pretty? Yeah, daring one-liners, if I could say. You do understand what's going on here, right? At this point, yeah. two other customers came. They don't need no bells in there. 
And there's a chime. There's a chime. But there's like a chime. Chime. Uh, And those are the two girls, of course, Kohane and Sai. Ah. Uh, the I two of you saw us out there. <laughs> <laughs> so, like, on the oh, way hi. here. Hey, you uh-huh. two. Hi. Question. Question. Uh huh. Because the boss is missing, do I still get to keep my job? <laughs> yes, you are so <laughs> detective. Yes. You mean, I, I, aren't you just a garbage lady now? <laughs> The, the other job, the other job one. I mean, uh-huh. yeah. I mean, if Satoru still think of him as the boss, then you're, it means I still keep my job, right? You're, you're it's not, not like I'm officially fired. Lady. Yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah, I'm not only a garbage lady. Okay. Thank mm. God. Basically, I'm complaining on the way here. Like I'm basically complaining to Saya about like how, like I got nothing else to do other than doing the garbage pile, and because I got nothing, no spare time to do any other thing, as in. No other side jobs, so mm-hmm. I've been just getting more and more shifts from the garbage lady owners. <laughs> and I'm like, can you believe that I don't get? I don't. my other job is right now like very very, you know, basically non-existent. <laughs> and your your conversation is literally cut by you know. Yeah, by you. by like getting getting into the store uh, the and then like looking at something like. There. Oh, oh, you're still alive. <laughs> oh, hi, dude. <laughs> he, he me me, me to the shopkeeper. He, he lo- Satoru looks at you and... We, we met in the office like... Two hours ago. Yeah, but... We literally do nothing though. And you just like... Get out and you're here? What to do? Well... Let me finish my conversation. So... He looks at... Uh, he looks at... Uh, Murata. Okay, and I'm like in cha- uh, being chattery with Sai in the background. Like, hey, do you want this? You see this? So I, I, yeah, I, I mean, so well, has this like the last time we met? List of items to buy, and she's like, but yeah, and and, 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 and Kohane is like basically, uh, you know, kind of judging every single item that the kids want. Like, they actually sell this kind of candy here, a cola taste. What the hell? Yes, like, Sorry, you do. Sorry, chill. So, Mr. Murata, does all of that ring any? Did all of that ring any bell? I, I mean, the cola candy. The ring just uh, the bell just rang. Oh, for but fuck's if you, oh my God, kids nowadays language. Oh God, that's why you work with that detective. <laughs> Fine, if that's a. How you want to do this? And he he walks to you, and then he put like put his hand in his pocket and take out like this set of keys. Oh, whoa, whoa. is that a gun? Oh, whoa, no, no, it's not. Okay, he, a <laughs> set of keys with this keychain that is of um. It's my favorite candy. Of a uh, little lamb, and it's wishes. Why the snow? Uh, he just put yeah. it there on the table and then he looks at you. One of the victims took this from the one who attacked them. And I believe you know what this is, right? Uh, keychain. Duh. Well, as you see that, um, it is a conversation that you have with um, your empl- your your employee before, you know. Mm. Um, so it's clear for you in your mind that it's um, it's she, it's Marius. You know? I know, I know. And uh, you know, she literally get it because you know she's she's married, had a little lamb. <laughs> Oh yeah, guess God. who's who? Guess who's the boss? <laughs> He's just. I hope you know what to do with this. Ah, oh, here's the thing. Um, as you can see, she's not working in here anymore. So if you're, uh, you know, if your detective, uh, your detective boss leave you, you need some. I don't know, uh, rice to eat. I know. The, the the vacancy is always open. 
that's actually a good offer, but I am legally obligated to work there, but it doesn't exactly matter right now. <sighs> work sounds hard, huh, Chief? It is hard when you're, um, you're a death sentence inmate, but yeah. So I kind of goes rigid at that. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> she's, she's like listening. So when when Satoru says that, she's like, "Sir." Yeah. Y yes. I hope you will do the right thing. I hope so. I mean, I don't know if people will use the pencil for evil doings, but yeah, we'll try. We always establish good demeanors in these jobs, at least for the customers. I believe that people who buy stationery is not is never a bad guy? Question mark. Because what they gonna do with the pencil? Step them with the with the uh, step their eye with the pencil, like that one, you know, assassins, a famous one. He's still a good guy, though. Just saying. I know. He is a good guy. One last thing. Do you know where she is? Your associate. My associate? I never, uh, I haven't seen her since that one day of, you know, the concert. So, um, oh. Go on. Yes, Miss, uh, uh, Yurikuma? Um, um, Arashi? you see that you... <laughs> <laughs> You see that Sai in her arms has already has like a bunch of stationery, like candies. very very cute, yeah, and 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 like candies, and she kind of like slowly turns to Murata and it's like um, well um, uh, uh, actually, I think I saw her yesterday night. Oh God, you can you can ask her. She's knows better than me. No, I I mean um, well, she she was actually attacking a a man. Well, ain't that a surprise? <laughs> While holding the the newspaper, like waving it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and um, when when I came to interrupt, she, well, she looked at me and then she ran away. So. There's, there's that. Also, where, how where much? More? Also, how much is the peach shaped candy? The peach shaped candy should be all. Uh, is it the small one, like the singular ones, or like the big pack one? Huge one, the huge one. Huge one with like a lot of uh, candies inside, or like one big huge one. The, the one big huge one with sparkle the, and glitter on it. The one with the sparkle and glitter on it. Oh, for you, fair lady, two hundred yen. Yeah, it's okay. Oh, we'll buy two for like a three hundred. We'll buy two of them. Come on. Come on. Will, will, will you buy the pencils as well? Well, she actually um, got a bunch of stationery. Just take okay, it. Okay, what the hell? Take, 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 take three hundred for two. Okay, actually, like two hundred and seventy-five. How about that? No. Come on. Just keep joking. Okay, find this three hundred. So anyway. I make you... this bum myself. <laughs> I I guess these speeches like are made from gold. Cannot lie. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nice to know that it's handmade. Here's oh, I... the, 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 uh, oh, bum made? Yeah. Bum All made. Right. Bum made. You really wanted this candy, so I'm sure you don't want any other shape candy, but sure, here. I already paid. Oh, mm, don't say that out loud. All right, Satoru, so you got case. You still got job after. Boss gone, isn't that nice? Mm. He looks at you. <laughs> to be fair, it is. It will be your job too because I'm bringing this to the office. But 
I'll see you guys later. Have fun eating the peach. Well, the butt-shaped candy. <laughs> he smiles to you, Murata, and just nods. And um, as he walked away, he looks at Sai. I need to talk to you after this, so... Uh, right. I'll, I'll wait. It's and okay, just finish your butt candy buying thing. Uh, Buy for me too. Uh, Buy one for me too. No, that other one is for me. Hell no. Nah. Buy yourself, dude. Oh, come on, honey. I'll, I'll <sighs> get him. I'll get him. I'll get, I'll get him one. <laughs> Thank you. You know what? Just give him you one also. and make him like share it with Dennis or something. It's fine. Sai so just like shakes her head like, get along, children. Come on, he's... He always get the cool stuff, you know? He's always get the cool case from the boss and I'm like, oh, like... This one no case hunting this uh, spouse or whatever something something. It's always like a lame weak one, and you always get the cool one. I wonder if that uh, has something to do with you having a cool power too. No. Hmm? And I Who's thought I, I I thought you were having fun garbage picking. Yeah, I mean it's kind of convenient, and also the money is good and convenient. Mm -hmm. Is yeah, it good so, enough? Sir, is it good, good enough, enough to buy? To buy another peach candy? So if you can you throw this peach candy for free because we're gonna buy this whole a lot of stationery and we already buy like two peach candy? <laughs> Sai so just goes to the counter and just like <laughs> just like whole bunch of stationery. <laughs> can you like throw two peach candy for bonus? I try winking to the old man. I know it's not working. That's so both old. <laughs> you guys are talking to Murata, I am sure. Yes. Murata? Yes, yes, yes. It's not working. <laughs> yeah, just stay silent. <laughs> like, <laughs> fine. So Sai Sai takes out like her wallet and like, all right. Uh, can you total it out all of this? Yes, that would be me looking at the cashier to make sure he he counted right and not trying to like <laughs> overprice things. Sai is whispering to Kohani like, honey, you're scaring the man. I don't think he's scared. Well, one thing before I before we proceed though, Murata, is Sekahika using like a modern system like you know like ding, 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 uh, using ding, ding. using a tab a tablet well, like or like poa. a PC or are you using you know some poa? Cash register, dude. I count with my hand. Yeah, the old suaranya gede banget itu nya. Like the, only, the, the ones that only have like the LED, like the, the <laughs> like that, that one. Yeah, the, 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 the green the one. The, one. Oh the, the green LED yeah. that looks like a detonator. Yeah, you have like all the tapes on the <laughs> the buttons for like shortcuts and everything. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Ah, that would be with all the stationery as well, minus the service fee. Mm. <laughs> service fee? Seven hundred. Okay, and Sai just opens her wallet and takes out a few coins. Um, do you have a bag? In this economy. Of course we have. Right. We have a lot of options. Oh, okay. Do you want the papers one? Do you want the biodegradable one? Do you want the the one that made from newspaper? But somehow if you get into the water, it's just like combust. <laughs> you you can see that Sai is like visibly overwhelmed. So she just like um just a just a normal paper bag, please. Okay, here's here's the one. It's not it's not it's not charged. It's okay. Just make sure you come back here for any other of your needs. I, I, I will I'll keep an eye on you. <laughs> I, 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 I thank thank you, um, honey. You she just like she yeah. just <laughs> pokes at honey. Wait 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 wait. Yes. Here's some small candies for you. You might need it. Uh, me? Yes, you, Miss uh, uh, you, uh, you, you, you Kurima, you. Uh almost but thank you yeah um have a have a good day well have a good day murabito-san <laughs> you're welcome Honey. please Kohane always come on. back for your stationery or other things that somehow the uh is being sold here yes yes only if you kind of like maybe sell gums 
Gak pas. Uh, we have we have some issues with gum. So I'll tell you, that's another like whole paragraph. <laughs> Kalau Not... saya terlalu walking out, like yes, okay. She uh, sighs like tailing right behind Kohane, but she just like quickly glances back. Um, thank you. Have a nice day. You too. So, <sighs> as those two left the premise, Murata, you're looking at that um thing. <sighs> What do you want to do? The uh, the, the keychains. Yeah. yeah. Murata's just like. Oh, why I'm calling myself Murata? Casey is just like, <laughs> like, uh, like, laid backly uh, sitting on, on his stools while rocking it down while knowing that it could make him fall because uh, a stool is not for make for rocking. In yeah, it's just like looking uh, 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 holding it up in the air while looking at it without saying a word. Sure. And then he fell. <laughs> of course. <laughs> It's like poof. Good. Yes. Um as you do that, uh can you pass roll I uh, uh an identify many for check so intellect check. Intellect. Mm-hmm. Hell yeah. My favorite rolls. I know. Not mine. <laughs> mine. Hey, come on, Oh hell yeah! Like, ooh. <laughs> Are you going? Uh, do ooh. you want to influence them? Nice, so smart bitch. Fine. I mean, I own business. Oh, I'm on business, ma'am. 19. Oh. You know the the moment you fell down pff, to the back, and like the 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 keychain is like uh, just just uh fell like from your hand. It just it got tossed like probably a few centimeters off your hand. Just take a, a a close look at it for like a few minutes, uh, like a few seconds. Um, as if like there's that eureka moment where like you realize that that um that locker, uh, that no that that key is a key to like a public locker. That's oh. probably well, and the only one um of those public lockers thing are around uh the um Sukimori Station. Okay. And you see the number 44 on the key. Wow! What a con- uh, what what uh, what a coincidence. <laughs> you know, anime moment. <laughs> I am. Uh, and that's the scene. Before I go before to the next, move, uh, gone. Be- before gone? you go to the next one, how could you even remember Yuri Kumara? I mean. <laughs> Yeah, I, You're I, talking I didn't, to you, I Ezra van Lune. <laughs> oh, that's I, 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 I was also surprised when you said Yurikuma Arashi. Oh my god! <laughs> like you said Yurikuma Arashi. <laughs> I'm like, oh, Yurikuma Arashi. I mean, it's Yurikuma Arashi for God's sake. Oh, yeah, I know. okay. Let's continue with the session. Uh, before I continue to the next scene, the next scene will be for you. Um, you can meet us. Hi, hi. Um, uh, but no rest for the wicked. Before, yeah, well, before uh, because Kohane rolled the appearance check before, so Kohane, I ask you the question. Um, you see, Satoru looks like he wants to. Uh, Satoru looks like he wanted to talk to Sai. Are you going to let them just walk alone, or are you going to leave them, or just going to be like the na- uh, the nosy aunt and follow them around? I feel bad because of the call. I would let them talk. I don't want to take responsibility <laughs> of my action. I would not take any responsibility about that. All right. The loud like, speaker. Okay, seems like you both have something to talk about. So I'm just gonna skip away first. Do you need me to bring this like candies and stationery to the to the you know orphanage first before like you could talk? So you could talk like a long um, time. I, I will bring uh, this um, back. And um, then and I... uh, Satoru just said, "I can carry them for her." No, 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 no! It's alright. What if you talk? I'm gonna. Yeah, I, I actually don't need to do something at all. Wait, 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 honey! Wait, 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 honey! No, I didn't she get just... the way. No, 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 no! no. I, I want the candy. Oh, right! I forgot. Sorry, this one, the bad one. Oh, and this is Thank for you. the Satoru. Tell him to share it with Dennis. Thank you. Bye. Thank you for the bump. Bye, bye. Just leave them alone. Yeah, I don't uh... want to have any responsibility for that. <laughs> of course. 
As we go to... Hi, Yukimura Sire. Uh, Are you all right? Uh, Sire? Or me? The... <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to make it personal. Kau bertanya. <laughs> No, 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 of course, you of course, of course, of course, my god, <laughs> is it Sire or me? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Reza, but it's Sire. definitely not okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, of course, oh, of course, it's not about me. Nice, size, size, okay. Um, but yeah, the, the, the two of you start walking together and. Uh, the first thing Satoru said was like, "Man, when was the last time we did this?" Hmm. What? Just walk home? Yeah, something like that. Well, I suppose uh, high school. High school. Yeah. I mean, we always we always walk home all the time. It's not like you. We would, literally you know. slept in in you know, in the same house. So. <laughs> yeah. So I heard from Danish that mm. he's back. Right. Yeah. He just Satoru. He just came out of nowhere. I don't... Why now? Probably got some, something to do with the angel bullshit. I'm... Sorry for the language. Five years of prison. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, maybe five years ago I would be surprised, but... You can talk however you want to talk. Saya, I don't think I have enough. I have much time left. Not in that sense, but in the. <laughs> Saya just stops kind of walking. Sense. <laughs> so the moment he says, Saya just stops walking. You can. <laughs> she doesn't even. She just stops walking. Has like peach candy on her head. She starts tearing up. You know. <laughs> he, he, he looks at you. No, no. Not in that sense. I apologize for the wording. It's you understand the situation why I'm here. It's the whole government program that you know forced me to well work as a kamigakari in returns of my well freedom. Sorry, but, just like, uh, but. But that Medeus is technically gone right now. I don't know when the the government will take that back and take me well, back to the prison. Can't we do anything about the other deadline? About our uncle, he meant? No, about you. You know, the only way to prove my innocence is... <sighs> You're free now, can't... Can't we just make it seem like you vanished or something? He, he, well, I didn't tell. Well, I'm not even sure Kohani knows about that. But like he, 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 uh, what's it? Lift up one of like the legs of his pants and show like the ankle monitor. <sighs> yeah. Okay, but what if? Sai <laughs> is just like thinking really hard. Okay, but what if we get? 
somebody to open it and then you can switch place with me you know like they won't tell the difference i can just go from like the like the orphanage to amadeus and then you can like i don't know run we're talking about the 444 division here you know it's not just <sighs> mechanical anyway besides wanna... the point About this Kuchisake or nothing. Oh, her, right. And probably the angel thing that's going on as he pointed the, uh, as he points to the the, the sky, mm. uh, the eye, all-seeing eye. <laughs> he said, "I think I need your help." Oh. What do you want me to do? I don't think I can trust Murata Keshi on this. Ah, the or stationary. The stationary guy, yes. Ah. I mean, I mean, our uncle got involved, and Amadeus also. And looks like Murata is the is someone that they're trying to recruit to. And also that creepy. Right. Creepy guy. Um, I forgot what his name, but. So. I can't trust one of the fishing. I see. But how do I play into this? I need you to follow him. Oh. Um, please. Oh, uh, all the please time? With a... Not all the time, but at least now. I I hope he took the bait and led us somewhere because I gave him the key to a locker and in the station. Oh, that, that was a bait. Oh, I see. Well, um, if he follows that bait, then... We're probably going to reach some mm, Sai kind of like fidgets, like thinking like, um, wow, I'll have to adjust a few things back in Himawari, but I'm um, Toru, what if, what if he finds out that I'm following him? He's an easygoing guy, probably, I don't know, but. Well, you have your Kazahana, so you can definitely protect yourself. <laughs> Sai just goes pale like, uh... You want... Oh, uh, oh, all right. I, 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 I think I can... Hey, you're my mm -hmm. twin. Right? Mm -mm -mm -mm, not in, not in pr prowess, but, but... Well, not exactly in blood either, but you know, I, you, you I know. know what I meant. You, you, you know, you know. One of these days, you're going to confuse people with the twin thing. Even Hani was confused by it. I think she's still confused by that. She's not exactly, <laughs> you know, know, the brightest of the detective. Sai <laughs> so, so laughs, but like immediately, like cock up her hand. It's like. <laughs> <laughs> Neither um, am I. He just put like then his uh, he he just put his um both of his hand on your shoulder and he said, "You're a daughter of a Tachibana, the the Tachibana clan, so you're definitely strong enough to fight whatever Murata she is." Please. Um. You know, after hearing that, size size face kind of like visibly deflates a little bit. She's like, you know. You know, you're the only one who says that, right? <laughs> Whatever I have one say. If I knew. You are a Tachibana. Sorry. D 
do you think we should well now that you know goro is back and everything do you, you think we should tell other people about this you meant kai <sighs> yes i meant kai let him be but what if what if goro comes after him we'll worry about that later <sighs> and sai kind of like grabs one of the hands that's on her shoulder like squeezes it a little bit all right all right so follow Murata Keshi and if he finds out that I'm following him um I uh, beat him up not immediately he probably would if he I, I, act I, I, hostile I think, right 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 jeez <sighs> she's I... sorry I spent too much time with Kohane uh, well, you did. You definitely did. Mm. Okay. Well, what are you gonna be doing in the meantime then? I will investigate the rest. I need to look for my boss. I don't think Kohani or Danish are in the right mind to do this. I'm sure they're attached to Amadeus. I don't want <sighs> them to. I'll do things the hard way. Right. Well, Sai pulls out her flip phone and just like, I guess I can go back to Sekahika. Uh, maybe I'll tell Hane that there's, I forgot, an emergency grocery or something. Um, Are you going to go now? Yeah. Um, I'll go now. Please be careful, Satoru. Of course. And uh, Sai uh, will... Uh, oh, no, Sai, Sai will just like look at him and then nods and then turns her back. And then he said, oh, right, go on. Uh, right, Sai. Uh, right, yeah. I mean, if you still... Don't want to be adopted to Dachiba and I can always help you be one. He smiles. What do you... Never mind. And then he walks away. <laughs> what? Sai so, 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 so just like looks at him and just like... Ah. And then she... Very slowly turns around. Is he, uh, is he walking away? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I, so I, so and I will walk And that's the last time you saw him. <laughs> no! no! <laughs> nah. <laughs> oh, God. Well... As we go to the next scene, you know this is coming. But I go on it. What? Hello. Yeah, what is it? Also, it just looks like an office. Yeah. yeah. Let, let us see your now. Is, is that Layla? Is that Layla? Yes, it is. Oh, 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 Layla. Check it out. <laughs> oh my oh. Oh, oh god. Uh Layla Before before I continue to the next scene, please introduce yourself and your character. <laughs> Are we going to do this? Like yeah. in the middle of the scene, okay? I know. <laughs> Alright, I know right. Okay. Hello everyone, sorry for being late. My name is Layla Austromedia and tonight I will be playing Frederick Alfonsina Hexenmeister. That's all. Yeah, please continue. Thank you. <laughs>
Thank you, Lady Hamster X and Meister. I almost call you Lady Hamster. <laughs> hamster Arc! Really hamster really Arc! Space Hi, Hamster Arc! Mine! <laughs> oh no, are you, gonna, are you gonna bring the actual hamster? You sounded like you're dying, but that's good. No, no, no! Jiman, what have you done? What did I'm Pajiman sorry. Do? Is it my fault to give me to give her a squeaky hamsters? <laughs> yes, I could hear it both IRL and in the disco. <laughs> oh god. Anyway, hi, go honey. Yeah. After your kind of laid back trip with um Sai, you know. Mm-hmm. Doing some shopping. You're back in your office. And again, you can feel the same cold air that has been there for at least two weeks. You know, it's... it's For you and Danish who's been here, who have been here for like at least five years... I believe you've been here for nine years. It's, uh, yeah. You know, Amadeus' departure was kind of big, right? Mm -hmm. But more than that, both of you who are now inside the detective agency, especially you know, as you arrived, you guys can feel, well, still feel that Sadness coming from Amadeus' well, daughter, who is also working for the agency. Who is still a high schooler. Nadia. You know, like, for the past two weeks, just been, like... She hasn't been functioning. She's just staying in front of her computer and... Browse the Pathfinder. Sometimes laugh at some stupid meme or something. Hey, mood. That's me for real. Me every day. I know. <laughs> Sending those memes to her friends on some Facebook group. That's so hard. <laughs> oh my god, I cannot believe you're calling someone oh like this. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god! Especially around like it's one her. to two o'clock. It's clock. her. <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying that it's her. It's so familiar. <laughs> Too real. <laughs> it's still like Danish and Wolks to gun. Yet anything this time? I mean, just, nope. just, she haven't even eaten any lunch, so. I don't really know what to do in this situation. I never have a child, let alone like I don't have I've never got a relationship, let alone a child. I don't know what to do. Well, you don't have a child, but you're old enough to. Yeah, but I never had one. Well, I guess so, but I mean, I'm I'm not ma maternal at all. Where's Where's your friend? Um, the, you know. Yeah, the one who deals with child. Exactly. Yeah. Where is she? Where, where, where is when we need them? Why didn't you bring her here? No, here's the thing. She met Satoru on the way. We were, we were outing. I was like about to bridging into like, hey, maybe you want to come to the office and help me like deal with this child. Oh that my. didn't help. But, <sighs> but she met Satoru. And I, you know, I've been avoid like, I'm me met Satoru. Fine. That's normal. Me met her. Fine. But I've been trying to not be on the same room as the both of them at the same time because you know All that right, mishap that, happened yeah. because of well, that. Mm, yeah, I kind of still feel bad about it, and I don't want to be awkward. Maybe next time you should fucking listen to me. Listen to what? I was listening with loudspeaker. Well, next time, I don't okay. know. Do not use loudspeaker on public like an old woman. 
It was very noisy, and if it's not on loud speaker, I can't really hear it. Okay, fine, fine. Like so, she's like <laughs> get up from from her <laughs> from her chair and like <clears throat> sliding like oh, there, Nadia, and like kind of checking up on her. You know, like at the kind of meme that she said. Yeah, you got close like, to just, her. Just, just, you know, laying around, be, be, being very, you know, you know how your parents usually very annoying and like laying around you and I just know. like looking at you, but then like don't really want to talk, but you know that they want to say something, you know, that's she, very awkward position, just, that's what she did. Yeah, she just says like, you know, you're not invisible, right? <laughs> she, not yet, so. Yeah. I am not. Uh... Yeah, I, I don't know. Well, Look, don't I'm you not know. very good. I'm not very good at this. Uh, well, duh. Yeah, <laughs> like, I don't know, man. Right. Um, internet. Uh. You know the 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 memes. <laughs> so you're just doing it, hey fellow kids. <laughs> the internet. That's that's the best you can come up with. She's an old woman. What do you expect from her? What the fuck? Oh my god. You know, like uh, <clears throat> uh, it's a. Uh, I, I don't I actually understand the memes, never mind, but uh, right, you've been, I, I know you've been keeping yourself busy with um, the internet and stuff you're doing there. Mm, were you like doing that as a coping mechanism or are you actually like looking for your father as well? Like like the rest of us do, like no worries, we, we also looking for him. N Nad kind of. Nadia looks at him. Sheesh, if this is how you talk to someone who's down, no wonder you're single. You know, for for this moment, yeah, I, w I will not actually argue with you because I know you're very sad and I don't want to argue with sad person. But yeah, I don't know how to talk to, to sad people. Just talk normally. Okay, so... Do you know that your, your dad is whatever the kid nowadays says, um, sus? Like, do you know that he's, you know, sus? Vicious? At the end of the day, she's saying the whole thing. I know. You know? S since when? I mean, I listen to everything. So your dad was like doing this very weird thing of a uh, demanding a child, which is kind of weird. I'm sorry, I know I'm talking about your dad, but like he was demanding us to give him an underage person, and that was pretty confusing for me. Uh, your your dad is a good person, right? Like he's not into weird stuff, right? Right? Right, since you listen to everything. I'm sure he is. And that's why but I just don't understand why he can't talk to us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly, exactly. But but at least you know, one of the worst possibilities is, you know, scratch. <sighs> Thank God. Yeah, but then again. I, you know what? I just don't know. Mm-hmm. I don't know what to do. You wanna try eating out with me? I don't know, hang out with this old lady. I'm kinda alone too. And I know that you know where the best place in town is. And I don't know, maybe you can do that thing that you always wanted. You, you keep critic me about how my fashion sense is shit and how my makeup is pretty weird. Maybe you can do the thing that you always wanted to do to me, like a makeover and stuff. I'll let you do it this time, but please don't make it so weird or like so uncomfortable. But if, you, if that could make you feel better, sure. 
I guess we can do that later. Okay, what do you want to do now? You want to eat? Have you eat? Treat me to a barbecue. Eat? Which one? <laughs> Trying to like recall the prices of every the single barbecue one, in town. The all you can eat one with the pineapple thing. Is it uh, the one beside Hosino's one? The one that is like a little bit pricier than yes. Hosino's one, please? I'll take you there. Unless you stay at the office, I cannot afford to pay for you too unless you want to pay for yourself, alright? We're going to barbecue. Nadia, Nad, Nadia just, you know, grins, but you can still see, like, the sadness in her eyes, you know? It's like, she, mm -hmm. she's forcing herself, like... Yeah. You know, like... Despite whatever she said... <laughs> the fact that she can say those things, like, it's just, it's just proof enough that she is at least one of the like you know the most attentive person inside the the office mm -hmm, she'll mm -hmm. she'll like you can see it you can feel that she also understand that it's hard for the two of you mm -hmm. so you can see that she's trying to force a smile right now quite mm, mature for someone her age yeah and she's not gonna comment on that <laughs> of course and so you look at Danish, <laughs> you are going to say, you know, make that comment. You see Danish is like, having like this serious face that doesn't look like, you know, normal Danish expression at all. Uh -huh. Knowing what happened <laughs> two weeks ago, knowing who he is. <laughs> <laughs> you can see like, it's that kind of business. Yeah. And he then walks to the two of you and... I I know that timing is really bad, but I really need to go for a while. Oh, for some reason, like that he thought... sounds like extremely serious right now. Yeah, and her mind is either like, "Oh, did he did he gonna go like and never come back because his identity is broken to me, or is he planning to kill me when I'm out eating with this girl?" And she's like, "Um." Mm -hmm. Okay, take, take care. She said, it's okay, I'll be back probably in a few weeks, but there's a lot of things that I need to oh, report to my, mm -hmm. he, to my, as he, he, he looks at Nadia and he looks at you again, parents. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know, say, say are, hi to your parents. Yeah. Uh, tell, tell them that I saved your life. You know, Thank the flight you. back home is tomorrow, so they want mm -hmm. me to go home, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah just, just tell them that I save your life. You of know, course. like like she wink, like, but please don't kill me. <laughs> of course. Yes. All right. So shall we try to, like, fill our bellies now? Nadia? Like, she understand that, like, whatever this going on, like, you can't just erase somebody's sadness just with food and stuff, but at least, at least she's eating, she's, she, at yeah. least she need to be healthy, Pian. Um, so, yeah. So, uh, and then uh, he then said, like, by the way, Kwani. Mm -hmm. He, like, he, he whispered to you a little bit. Keep that USB stick. What, what, what's come again? Keep that USB stick, he said. Okay. Nadia will know <laughs> how to access the, fi the files inside. But do you want me to access it after you gone immediately or if you don't come back? It is up to you. <laughs> well, be sure to treat me to those, that, that pineapple barbecue thing. And then he, he pads like Nadia's shoulder and Take care, kid. And he walks away. Okay, let's go. Let's get some food. So what do you want to do? Go to the the place uh, beside Hoshino's shop that sells barbecue with pineapple. <laughs> sure. <laughs> I want to um, Before you walk away, you can hear the bell rings. Ding, ding. It's the bell for clients. Like, there, there's a specific... A bell that like potential clients need to like to ring to uh notice uh, notify everyone anyone inside that it's 
you know, a potential client. Oh, okay. Like, Nadia, do you want to go there first? And like, you know what? Bring bring my wallet. You can you, you, you order see, it like, first. Hearing, or hearing hearing that bell, you see Nadia's like face like change a little bit excited. You can see like a little bit of excitement inside in her face. And... Okay, never mind. Let's meet the client. <laughs> Like, like she was ready to like just give the money and actually like praying God please don't let her um I don't know spend the money on expensive stuff and then look in her face oh, okay never mind okay, the <laughs> so uh letting the client in <laughs> why did I say that with that tone <laughs> you see uh you know a a, a male. A human, dude, of course. A human. Well, of course, there's no Duh. other ladies. Duh, there's no elf. Uh, technically, there's an elf here in this thing. <laughs> wow. But yes, um, there's a dude. There's a guy showing up. He is, um, you know, around 165, 175 centimeters tall. Has the short black hair and a pa- wearing a pair of glasses. You see, uh, this guy. I don't know why I react before the photo even appear. But I'm <laughs> sure you already. <laughs> do. Where is it? Where is it? You see this guy. Ah, uh, <laughs> actually <laughs> exactly the same. <laughs> <laughs> and then he he say that is is. Is, is this the the um the the detective agency thing? Oh yeah. Uh, what can we help? Like, is she they it like she don't usually do this thing because usually other people take this job as the front lady, the one who get the client, and she's like doing just doing the job on the side. But this time nobody is particularly here except her and Nadia. So she takes the charge even though she's not used to it. And she's like, okay, so yeah, uh, you can sit. Uh, sure. Um, thank you. And then he, he, he sat in front of you and, um, I need your help. Obviously, <laughs> uh, <Yeah. laughs> I I just just came here a few days ago, and um, I need your help to look for someone. Someone interesting, a uh, person missing. Do you have like? Oh, by the way, uh, I'm I'm uh, I'm this, and then he he gave you like a you know a uh, name card. Mm-hmm. What's his name? Can, can you read from uh, The name inside is Shirai Shitoru. Let me just get your uh, database on this card, on this file, sir. Wait a bit. H. Um, 38. I know uh... I look young. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, sir. Pretty young, sir. Uh-huh. Yes. Uh, okay, H. I'll just assume the other stuff. Where do you live, sir? You usually from here, or? Ah, uh, no, I don't exactly live here. I. Ah, uh, I'm I'm from Shibuya. Ah, so what are yeah. you doing around here? Why did you like visit? This okay, I I just need your agency. help to. Uh, mm-hmm. I I I need to look for my uh, sister. Mm, her her name mm-hmm. is Shiraishi Elena. Shiraishi, pardon? Elena. Okay. You know, without without an H, you know, like like Helena, without like an H in front of it. Ah, oh, okay, 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 okay. Yeah, we we kind of got separated years ago because of our parents' divorce and everything. Um. But but as uh, I'm just looking for her. Um, does she missing around this city? Is that, I, is that why you particularly go here no, and not in Shibuya? Well, the last thing I heard was that she moved here with my with our father after the divorce, and that's like so missing know, family three, member three huh? four years ago. Okay. 
do you have any like pictures or something to identify as her even though it's like three or four years ago like how old is she now i think right now she's around 17. okay so she was a child when she yes. was missing uh-huh do you have any picture of her like she might kind of change a lot but facial features she usually still stays uh, unfortunately i do not uh, yeah um huh yeah uh, yes yeah um no well, it's a long we'll... story well would you like to disclose the long story so like you know it it could probably help with the investigation if you don't mind uh, i'd like... rather not Well, if you're not cooperative, I, we also won't be able to give the base result for the search as well. So it would be helpful. Like, I don't know, her her height would be different. It's puberty. She would like grow a lot, but maybe skin colors or like the type of eyes, nose, like you could describe her. Please. Thank you. You know what? Mm -hmm. Please roll. <laughs> um, mm -hmm. A negotiate maneuver. So we'll check. A uh, will check. Well, 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 well. Man, inquisitive what? Nara is a new thing to me. 14! Why so dumb usually? <laughs> <laughs> no, rather than like dumb, like Nabel is you, it was like, you know, like. Nabel didn't exactly care about a lot of things. Uh, yeah, he don't. Do you want to influence that, nice. that one? No, my spirit pool is like four and three. It doesn't gonna change much. <laughs> it doesn't gonna change anything. Sure. So the fourteen. Um... Right. Mm... You see, like he. Took like at least a minute to think. To think. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's normal for a person who haven't seen a person for like years to forgot about the facial features right. and stuff. But, yeah, just asking around. Um, you don't have a picture, and you're searching for somebody. How do you think like, you're gonna find uh, it? It's Kohana's head. <laughs> well, the only thing I remember, mm -hmm. she has, you know, the my black hair and the glasses was uh, is actually you know, the glasses runs in the family um you know, like just the typical japanese of course mm -hmm. so like literally every single person you could find in the road true true um mm -hmm. I, i'm not exactly i'm not really good at this describing someone thing to be honest how about i don't know beauty mark uh, birthmark like the one you have on your cheek or something does she have that somewhere in her body that you know i don't know your parents know or maybe you could help by like identifying your father if you still remember your father like how that's you how did he look like because you could say that uh she moved in with your father right like after the divorce and stuff so maybe you could also give your father's identity like his name probably that would help right um you know after he said you know just like this pause mm -hmm. like at least like 30 seconds or so Gosh, I wanted to do inside check. She looks exactly like our other sister. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, let, let me let me show you the picture. Um. Oh, so you have the picture of your father's <laughs> sister, but you don't have the, a picture of your sister. Yeah, well, I have the picture of our sister. Uh -huh. I did yeah. well because she lived well. She lived with me, and yeah. But but um, I'll just show you the picture. And he 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 opened like his backpack and like take out like this picture. And like in the picture is um him, 
mm -hmm. and a woman, another woman. Mm -hmm. Let me think for a bit as a DM. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. uh, I think sure. I know what it is. <laughs> I will, <laughs> it's happening. I, will I don't know what it is. You, I, I will let you happening. roll. Uh, please roll an intellect check that is a recall check. Oh, holy shit, though. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, intellect. Why does he have to oh. think I don't feel like good? <laughs> Freaking <laughs> Lila. <laughs> Oh god. I will influence the two with four. Oh my god, you're going to influence this on 16? Yeah. Sure. Um ooh, okay. Uh on the picture that he gave you is basically this Polaroid picture. Mm hmm And he said, um, it's this is an old picture. Uh you know, um mm -hmm. So she well, so Elena will probably look like her, and he points at the the woman in the picture. So the the the, the picture is of uh, this guy, you know, this Toru guy, uh -huh. and um, a woman with long hair. She has this beautiful smile. Hello. But outside I... outside of like the the normal appearance of human. <laughs> I, I had like, uh, yeah, so, um, I, what is this loss? She have a long hair and beautiful smile, by the way. <laughs> yeah, what would that help with and the like she, she has like this, uh, you know, like just, just the normal typical Japanese, like with the black eyes and like she has like this, uh, almost like a paler skin. And in, in the middle of like, um, something that she, she looks a little bit mixed between like Japanese and like, um, a Western. But mm -hmm. if you just add some details on her face, particularly around her mouth, Beautiful you recognize smile. her. It's... It's a bloody... Uh, the Kuchisake one from the other day. Yeah, it's the... <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, the beautiful <laughs> smile, God damn it, the beautiful smile is relevant in this case, guys. Oh my god. Exactly, that's why I say beautiful smile. Uh, she <laughs> is beautiful. Uh, and he said, this is our sister, um, Maria, mm -hmm. and um, unfortunately mm -hmm. she died a few years ago, and... Um, wow. Elena right now is definitely going to be well. It's, it's probably will we'll probably look like her. I see. She's just like trying to keep her face normal, just like the the, the usual face. She she might not usually do this. Like she keep this on the job. Like even if she faces people, she would do you know the professional face and. Yeah, she kind of like stuff for a second when she look at the picture, but then like she's like, oh yeah, sure, okay. Sure, Her like, name is uh, Maria. As he, as he hold the picture, you see, um, immediately Nadia just goes there and, and uh, take the pi a picture of that picture and like go to the the computer, and, like start to typing mm -hmm. things, start to type things, like plug in uh, that that uh, phone to the PC and start to type things. Like she's just frantically like you know, doing her thing, and you see yeah. like she's just like. Uh, summon her, uh, what is it, like, um, glasses? Mm hmm That, you know, like, activates her, you know, Kamiya cut skills. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And started frantically typing, and... Yeah, that's the only information I, I got on her. Okay. So, at least we know, uh, know how she would probably look like, and... Also, I didn't catch your father's name again, you haven't told... Me about you know like his whereabouts would probably lead to your sister so oh right um it's Shiraisi Genzaburo Genzaburo exactly yes okay all right well well doing you... this you, you see like uh you can you can hear Nadia exclaim uh huh like uh uh, Kohane look at Nadia and like, you know, I talking of like, 
keep it for yourself first, we'll talk when the client's not here, like the usual stuff. Na Nadia, not in front of the client. Nadia looks at you and like, she, you can see like, she's a little bit pale. She's like pale and like, but uh, did, did she not? Kohana not, Kohana not, Kohana just not like, <laughs> not nicely, just just a nod. And like, you know, the eyes of like, we'll talk about that when the client's not here, like, mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. So she's like, okay, so can can I get your contact information so I could contact you if we got any, you know? Uh, should call oh, sure, my, my phone number is, in that, is on that card, yes. Okay, let me take note of it, alright. A second. Alright, thank you. <laughs> um, thank you, miss. And you too. And then he, he looks at Nadia and nods and... He, he walks away, Nadia just nods reluctantly. She gone. She gone for good. She's gone. He's, he's gone for good. Okay, he's gone for good. What Nadia is going to say next... ...is for later. <laughs> <laughs> As we go... ...to... ...Fred. All right. Okay, let me mute. Fred! Hi, Fred. Huh? Hi. Fleur de Lune High School. You know, it's been two weeks since the incident. Um, Two weeks ago. It's been two weeks <laughs> since the incident and the concert and everything. Um, mm -hmm. You were called to the principal office. And told to join the occult club for your safety. Mm -hmm. And um, the principal, Komore Bisuzu, told you that. Um, Hoshi Why, is the principal? Why is the principal would like to recommend that? <laughs> I know, right? That that Hoshi no Sera and um, Kurako will be joining you there too. Because of, you know, the three of you, like, you know, your involvement in the event in the concert oh my god the principal is into supernatural things she didn't tell you any details but she said kurako will be able to tell you what mm -hmm. and you go to the the door like you reach the door of a club room and walking in you already see you see two of the club members Sayo Kurako and Hoshino Sera Oh she's so small and cute Kurako you are in um you are in the club room with Hoshino Sera at you know after school and uh, um Will it be awkward or are you going to be a yandere? <laughs> Not both! <laughs> I see. <laughs> Wait, is Frederick now sitting? Uh, is she just like, she just entered the room? Before, before we do that... Um... So... As the sole member of a cult club, as Frederick walks into that room, describe what does the occult club really look like? Uh, well, it's probably like uh, it's like an abandoned club room <laughs> mm -hmm. because it's it doesn't, it doesn't have members, so you're not allowed to form clubs without members. So she kept on getting kicked from one club room to another, and at the very last, she uh, got the only place that is empty is you know the empty storage room. Uh, it used to be the probably baseball club's storage room, so uh -huh. there's some baseball stuffs inside, but there are still some tables, you know, and the smell of sweat. <laughs> it's been a while since the last time it's used as a storage room of the baseball club, but it still reeks of sweat. Uh, I mean, the, the, they, they occasionally take, you know, the stuff from inside the storage and just left it, you know. I, I guess so. Um, well, outside of it being, you know, former storage room for the baseball club, um, you see, uh, to your surprise, um, this time, well, it's a little bit cleaned up a little bit, probably by 
people that the principal, you know, ordered to. Um, but it's still this modest club room that you know, and the two of you are inside. And for some reason, uh, for some reason, Frederick emerge. Oh, she's ready for this. She grabs like this uh, air freshener from the corner of the room, and she just goes, "Shh." <laughs> Welcome, new brethren, to, to to the occult club club room. <coughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, excuse me. Uh, thank you for the welcome, but what did I just smell? I feel it's, like something no, just... No, I, I, I promise, <laughs> Miss Miss uh, Miss Frederick, this is mm -hmm. much, much better than the uh, the smell of, you know, dust and uh, a little <laughs> bit of sweat. Much better, mm -hmm. I, I promise. I'll open, I'll open the windows too, if you want to. Uh, oh, that's very kind of you. Yes, please. <laughs> Uh, oh, please, please sit down. Uh, 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 um, uh, uh, can, can I, uh, can I call call you? Uh, relax, please. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm uh, sorry. I'm just. Uh, Are you okay? Uh, yes, uh, Miss Fred. May I call you Fred Chan? Yeah. Uh, well, I don't mind as long as you do <laughs> not put okay. Miss in front of my name. Yeah, yeah. yeah I'm a uh, Oh, Fred, Fred Chan, Sarah Chan, do you want drinks? I have cola. I, I just bought it. <laughs> I ran to the store earlier for a little bit. So, you know, it's, oh my god, I, you shouldn't have done that. Thank you. Yeah, please, please. And she gave out the, this diet free cola to everybody. And diet free, I mean, zero sugar. I don't know what's it called. <laughs> diet free? <laughs> so it's. <laughs> So it's just oh, extremely no, no. sweet. It's just like a diet. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's like a diet. It's just like a diet. Diet free. Diet free. Diet free. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> diet free means... Zero sugar. Not, zero sugar. That is not even for consumption. Yeah. Zero, zero sugar. Zero sugar. So it's like... Two, <laughs> like a thousand no, percent no. sugar <laughs> as usual. <laughs> it's sugar free cola. <laughs> and then it, it's still cold. You know that she took it from the back, the very back of like the vending machine. She got lucky. And she's like, she sat down uh, at the very end of the table. There's like, there's like one chair that that's the most creakiest chair, but she gave all the good chairs to you guys. And she's just smiling from ear to ear. You know, not, not like Shiraishi Maria, just, just normal smile. I know. <laughs> But it's a, it's a, you know, she hasn't smelled this widely for a very long time, so it, it, it's kind of creepy. Uh huh. But she, she th that smells genuine, and she's like, so, um, starting today, um, I I'd like to welcome you to the to the occult club. Um, can you explain why we're? Here because you know, I mean, with all the things that happened, and uh, Mr. Principal just told me to be here. Oh, 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 I never oh, signed. Oh. I, I never signed to the club because usually I don't have time for clubs. Yeah, so, yeah, you oh. know. Oh, you, you, don't, don't don't worry, Mr. Fred. I mean, Fred. Uh, uh, put, uh, drop, drop the miss. Yes. Oh, okay, Fred. So it's it's actually really simple. Um, uh, dangers, uh, you know, the, the eye in the sky, <clears throat> the thing that happened to Serata, and, and you know, we were together, and apparently, it turns out, uh, Miss Principal uh, kept a lot of like weird people in this school uh, together. So, a lot of people have like connection to the occult, which is like totally awesome i thought it was just mm. me for the longest of time but turns out there's a lot of people in this school that is also tied to the occult and like probably some aramitamas or two i don't know i never asked i didn't have the courage but but because of that um the miss principals say that as long as we stick together especially especially the three of us we're gonna be just fine so at this point, Frederick is actually trying her best to hide that she's actually really into occult, especially since at this point, Frederick uh, still doesn't know that Kulako is the one that well, has talked to her back then, uh, back in the, you know, the online forum. Uh, so he, uh, 
So Frederick just smiled and tried to, you know, divert the conversation and said, Um, well, um, Kurako, is it okay if I also call you Kurako-chan as well? <laughs> I mean, well, yes! <laughs> um, well, thank you so much for for the explanation. Oh, by the way, if you want me to help with the, uh, you know, with the smell, I can always bring you some candles, you know, and maybe C -c candles. Yeah, L like like for ritual. <laughs> that that uh, would be that would be cute. Uh, uh, you know, uh, well, <laughs> Hoshino said I'd be like, can, can I call you Kurachan? Kurachan? Uh, I mean, uh, yes, sure. No. Or shall I call you president? Ah, uh, yeah, that's a good idea. She's the president of the club. Yeah, oh. I know, right? Mm -hmm. oh, 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 no, no, please, please, call me the president. Although true, it's a little too much, so I think Kura-chan is, is fine. Uh, Kura-chan saicho, eh? Kura saicho, eh? <laughs> Kaicho? Oops, sorry. Kaicho? Kaito? <laughs> yes! Yes! Well... Bucho, actually. It's, it's, it's Bucho, isn't it? It's Okaru Tobu. Bucho? Yeah, it's really? Bucho. <laughs> Bucho? Kura, <laughs> 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 Bucho-chan? Uh, <laughs> oh my god. Sera then... Sera then said... Uh, so, what do we do in your cult club? Oh... <laughs> Um, uh, uh, well, um, it, it has been only me for the longest of time, so I just, you know, uh, read up on, like, the newest uh, rumors regarding the occult, but, um, I, I, to be honest, I, I have no plans for an actual group activity. What do you usually do before this? While Frederick is uh, tampering with the, the cola because she's really happy to drink the zero cost. She doesn't really have the chance to drink this kind of drink, you know, because her family right, doesn't yeah. eat it. <laughs> <laughs> She's fascinated by the coke. <laughs> when you think about it, an Ojo sama, like a nerd, <laughs> like, is this Kayon? I don't know. <laughs> this is Kayon. <laughs> like, what have I done? Kayon and <laughs> what is this CGBCT I created? We are gonna form a band oh of my occult God. lovers. Go on, people. Yeah. So, um, but before I just I try out rituals. There are, you know, some people in the occult forum describes rituals like very, in 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 a lot of you know even the littlest details, and I just try them out to see if it works. It never works. Um, because I guess there's such things as compatibility even in the occult and like black magic, but that's like besides the point, right? Um, mm -hmm. I, I think, um, um, first of all, <clears throat> um, uh, 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 my first decree as, as the president is, uh, to, 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 to get to know my fellow uh, cult members oh, sorry. better. Uh, what's wrong? From the soda. Fred, oh, uh, are sorry, you sorry, I'm not really used to drink the soda, but it's okay. I like it. Uh, sorry, should I'm I sorry. should should I have gotten you like a sparkling water instead or uh, no 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 it's uh, it's okay it's okay sorry for being rude <laughs> please continue sorry for no 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 uh, th th that's that's good actually I I I would like to propose that that we we, we get to know each other better y you know um like uh, I'm uh, I I'll I'll start <clears throat> and she stood up from her chair you can tell that she's struggling a little. But probably with excitedness, question mark. Mm -hmm. Hello, my name is Sayo Kurako, and um, uh, I'm, uh, well, oh, uh, uh, how do we do this introduction thing again? Let's go, Kurachan! Uh, I mean, y you can call me Kurachan, and I, 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 I really like the occult, and um, um, every few days and such i actually go out at night to hunt for mononokes and, and stuff 
and, and evil spirits, uh, especially evil spirits. No, no, I, I don't, I don't devour um humans mm -mm. Uh, until now, at least. Uh, wait, 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 wait. De -de -de devour the, the small clap. <laughs> question, question, Kurachan, question. Yes, How did you first discover um about occult and fell in love with it? Oh, <laughs> uh, I don't know where to start. <laughs> so, uh, the first time it was, uh, I remember uh, I, I went, it was on a um, Kurako, your, on a trip. Your, 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 you know, sentence suddenly just got, uh, got what is it? Um, cut by this knock on the door. Um, there, there's, the, there's a voice from the other side of the door and say, uh, it says, uh, it's... Is this the occult club? <laughs> yes. Sarah immediately stands up and sh shall I open the door? Uh, uh, I, I mean, no, no. Uh, as well? the, the president, I, I should, I should open the door. It's, it's okay. St stay in your seat. I'm, I'm gonna. Uh, and she, she ran to the door and like. Scoop. Opening the door, you Are see another student of a fleur of Fleur Dillon. You know, private high school. Um, she is definitely a plain-looking senpai because because you see can see like you know the the, the ribbons of uh, each year are different, and hers is um, a second year one. You see this girl. Oh, where is she? Say this girl. This was suspicious looking. Suspicious looking. Um, is is this the the occult club? <laughs> yes. <clears throat> yes. This is the occult club. The 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 um. W would you also like to join? We we've just started group activities as of um, today. I no, I, I just, I just need your help. I, I don't know where to go to, but knowing that you guys are researching this thing, I, I hope you guys know about it. About, oh, please, uh, come, come in, take a seat, P please. I, I have d diet coke. Um. Thank you. Who's drinking it? It's, it's, it's such a delicious drink. She then walks in and she sat down on whatever chair was, um, you know, available, empty. Uh, and Sarah looks like, looks at the two of you and notice like, you know, um, just that clueless look on your face and she said, um, this is the second, uh, from the second year, um, Elena Senpai. Oh, you oh. know this person? My nice to meet you, Senpai. Well, Wait, is Senpai-chan a Senpai? No, 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 Sarah, Sarah is in your, you know, on your Ah, year. okay, okay. I, I just need your help, um. I'm not sure if I need. To, I, I have. To, I, I believe it's actually happening, but I really need your help. Uh, you, you need. Okay. Um. This is not this cat club, so. It's but, it's but... occult related. It's. Oh. Oh. I oh. Think. Yeah. Yes. Please. Please. Uh, anything. Anything occult. Really. Really. Um. She then sits. Down, uh. She she looks down. She fiddles a little bit. Um, I feel like I'm being haunted. Oh, haunted? Can when I check? Uh, can I check like the energy around her? Ooh! <laughs> <gasps> Inside check for magic? Question. Inside magic. check for magic. <laughs> 
Oh my that god, Kurako is very cool. Be, be, respect like, them. You are an arcane. Like, you're, you're the type of your fan set is actually arcane, I believe. Yeah. You're, um... Digital social... I'm an occultist. No. No, 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 no. no, actually, I'm a dark hunter. Oh, right, yeah. Um... You can roll for a praise maneuver. So roll for uh, intellect. An intellect ah, check. Oh, intellect check, okay. Yes. But... Oh. It's okay. There's no bad. Yay! 16. Do you want to influence that? Nah. So just 16. You do feel something around her. It's... It's a little bit mixed. You can feel a little, um... How do I say it? So you definitely can feel a curse around her. Just just that familiar area, because, fam familiar aura, because, you know, you yourself are kind of cursed by Angelica. Um, yeah. But the nature of that curse is somewhat ambiguous for you you know for as um Aww. for the you know for the past four years you know if you're doing this kamigakari thing you've met um a few anomalies here in the air but this one it's it you can feel the darkness in it you can feel the somewhat evil in nature in it but for some reason this evil aura is weirdly enough protecting her oh it's weird but yeah interesting so earlier kuraku was still like gleeful from all the uh, serotonin mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> for, from today's new uh events but as soon as she detected the aura uh, her face went back to normal uh -huh. and she just whispers please go on um i just feel like i've been followed by something for the past few weeks few days um but every time i turn around and look around i i don't Exactly, I, I have. I don't see whoever is following me. <gasps> like, like, like something dark and scary threatening your soul or something? Do you remember, like, where or what did you feel at first? Uh. I don't wow, that's... feel it around school. Whenever I go outside, whenever I walk home from school, I feel it the the strongest. But it gets stronger the closer I get to home. But do do you guys know all the 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 cases, the the assault cases are in? And the newspaper lately. Yes, yes. Uh, I, we, uh, I mean, uh, she looks around. At, at least I do. I I know a little bit more about that. I think from, um, yeah, the forums and stuff. So. Um, said I said. I, yeah, I know about that too. Yeah. Frederick stays quiet, but she looks at Kurako with sparkling eyes, like, you know, like, <laughs> looking up, like, OMG, this girl is so cool, she can yeah. sense all that bad things around her. <laughs> She's OG. Because, <laughs> yeah, because Frederick, Fred, uh, because uh, Frederick is actually, um, pretty a new nerd. at all of these things. <laughs> and she's, oh. she's only a nerd before, she's only a nerd, and she's pretty new at all of these things, so she became like... <gasps> Then um, the senpai of yours said, um, all of them happened around my neighborhood. And I just got a little bit scared. You know, I, I, I am I the next target? I, I, I don't know, but I'm sorry. Maybe uh, maybe it's my, just, mm, is um, it real? Is, is all of this 
spiritual thing real? Uh, yes. Um, I... You don't need to feel like, um... What's happening to you is is invalid. It it's I think it's very real, but but I I don't think you should be worried for now. Um, I I think something is might be um uh, interested in you, but I, I don't think it has any evil intentions for you for now. I, I see. Um, Sarah, then. I mean, if we're going to investigate, shall we go home with you after school, Senpai? That sounds like a good idea, right? Then she looks at you, Kurako. Go, go home. Are, are you okay, Kura, Kura, Kura chan? Uh, I'm okay, I'm sorry, I'm just... I choked on my own saliva. Um, I don't even know if that's... Go home to, to, together. Fr yeah. From school. Oh, right. Yeah. That's a, actually, that's a really brilliant idea. Because if, if we go home with you together from school every day to your home from school, that means we can also keep you safe in case anything happens i mean safe as in we could contact the authorities if it turns out it's a bad person etc not saying that you know we're gonna fight or anything no 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 frederick claps her hands and and just said oh, okay that's decided that's our first club activity together i guess her eyes still sparkling that that will help help yeah what do you think about it, Akura chan? Uh, oh, yes. Where, where is your your home, Miss? Uh, I mean, she 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 I she senpai? Um. Just a few blocks from here. Oh. Not that far from the station. Pretty close then, and then, um, you know, after that we can also walk to the station right after we take you home. So it's actually a really safe route for almost everybody, I, I think. She then not. Mm. So. Well, that's it then. I guess that's the plan for you guys, and that's unseen. Before I continue this session, it's already 11. Do you guys still have time or shall I end this early? Like we talked before. Do you? Do you still no, 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 have no, no. time? Do you? Do you? Do you? Do you? Do you? I can I'm, play I'm, I'm a little bit excited <laughs> right now, so I think I can Yeah, the, the excitement, sure it, the excitement, sure the euphoria, the serotonin is good for you. The adrenaline is rushing in. Is it good for you? Fine. Um, then I'll. Uh, the then we'll probably end this um, a little bit early. Uh, uh, for the last scene. Um, Here we go. I <laughs> want Murata Keshi. Oh, oh Godwin. <laughs> of course, it's, it's, the, it's the roof. Ono Kohane. <laughs> to please roll a luck check just oh, to determine oh. which scene that I want to go through. Oh, uh, uh, boys. Uh, uh, oh my god. Uh, well, let me just luck this. Yeah, just luck Damn, check. Luck, oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> Luck very well. Did, did you just roll a crit? Oh. <laughs> yeah! Oh my god! <laughs> Goodbye, Pokemon! I guess I it's cool. It's gonna be another rooftop moment. <laughs> oh. Then we'll go to uh, Murata's scene next, uh, first uh, thing in the next session. And God wins after, but this time, let's end this with Kohane's scene. Oh. What do do do?
Oh, is it the continuation? <laughs> continuation for what? Oh. All right. Go on, and you see. Um... Well, continuing the previous scene, you are with Nadia there. She she's frantically typing and everything, but you can see like she's she's a little bit pale, but like not not exactly scared in a way, but she's just um confused and extremely like have like this really suspicious um expression and mm -hmm. um yeah there's a way yeah I think there's a way so what is it. <sighs> Right, so, um, I hacked into a lot of things, uh, mm -hmm. and matched the, uh, the, well, the face of that lady on, on the, on the Polaroid, where, uh, to, um, a, a bunch of, um, algorithm, on, on, you know, our fa face recognition algorithm that I created with my mm -hmm. power, but, um, uh, first of all, um, mm -hmm. so, uh, she, she just scrolls like, okay, do, do you know that girl? You, you look like you do. Uh, she, 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 she's looking at you. Yeah, um, mm, not a, not, not a good news, actually. But yeah, I think if I recall correctly, I have seen her face somewhere, yeah? Uh, right, um, so, uh, sh Shirai Shimaria, that, that's her name. Uh, mm -hmm. Same same last name with uh, the the man and the, the mm -hmm. girl that he's looking mm -hmm. for, Shirai Shi and everything. And um, so, um, I assume the reason you know her because she is a Mononoke or something? Well, yeah, that's actually why it's a bad news. Yeah, so, uh, because what she died out? 10 years ago. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, the reason why she died 10 years ago is because she is killed. She was killed mm -hmm. by her boyfriend. Oh, thank God I never had one. Uh huh. Well, not just like that. Uh, so, um, I I couldn't find the name of the boyfriend or anything. Looks like a lot of things have been arranged or so. I don't know. Like for some reason, I can't I can't access them. But but I I look into her family, right? So, um, well, we did find Shiraishi Genzaburo and and all, mm -hmm. and I finally found Shiraishi Elena. Yes. Hmm. Okay. Um. So, good news. You can immediately find her. She's. A She's a student in the in Fleur del Lune High School right now, so you can definitely go go to her and um, mm -hmm. you isn't know, it, isn't it like Hoshino Hoshino School or something? Hoshino Seras, right? Yeah, Hoshino Seras and and those two girls that you met at in in the incident that I saw. Um, what's mm -hmm, mm -hmm. their names again? I don't know. I but... think one of them is like the the very famous kid of like the Hex and something, please. Ah, uh, right, yes. And the other one, I think I catch her name, it's just like, Kura, Kura, Kura... Kura? Kura-chan? Kura? Uh, I, I kura, see kura, kura. kura. Uh, well, the, 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 the hex and my star lady, and kura -chan, well, whoever they are. But yeah, um, uh -huh. I can look into this more because I, well, when I, I actually hacked one of my, well, really close internet friends IP sometimes and, and they sometimes use like different computers but like I track one of the IP to the Fleur de Lune you're um, kind of nasty you know what's like I I'm, I'm just saying but mm -hmm. I think my well this acquaintance of mine in the, the online is, is, a, is a Fleur de Lune student I don't know who she is who they are um, is, that, is it the one that you know, give you information. Exactly, about like the angel thing, you see. Mm -hmm. uh, but mm -hmm. it's definitely a she. It, because it's, you know, Florida and the girls' high school. But uh, mm -hmm. uh, I, I can ask her about it later. So, but, but you know, if you, if you, if you want to uh, look for her, you, you should definitely leave you until one. Yeah. Um, she, she looks a little bit panicking. Like she, she's just trying to piece out like all the information inside her head. It's like, I'm okay, done, I'm done. um, 
uh, if you want to look for Shiraishi Elena, then I, I suggest you to go to the Fleur Dillon High School right now because it's, you know, cl you know, um, going home from school time. Yeah, but does it really have to be today, though? S um, here's the thing. Why, why the urgency? Why, why are you social so social media, panicked? you know, like, social media is so big today. And, like, you know, like, Shira, it's like Elena, Shira, Shira, Elena is not exactly someone who, who, who kept, like, a lot of things, like, private. So, like, I, I hacked her, like, you know, like things. And, like, the uh -huh. one where, like, short videos. Like, the one with uh -huh. like, the, 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 the pictures and everything. So, uh, she talked about her sisters a lot. And someone who talks about her sister, it's, it's weird for someone who talks about her sister a lot to not talk about her long-lost brother. I don't think she have one. Be End of session. Shy. Okay, thank you, Mr. Boyfriend. And. Bye! <laughs> that is a problem for you guys in the next episode. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I never think Nobita is a fucking killer. info dump. Why did you save him? I don't know. <laughs> You should take your, your chicken nuggets have more I don't know more purpose in life than that man. God damn it. She doesn't oh, know that. <laughs> I'm like the moment you say it like oh somebody's knocking on the on the door. I'm like oh yeah it's high school. Wait high school. Ah uh, you know it's a senpai. They're 16. Senpai would be 17. Uh, <laughs> I'm already like type hum the chat. Hum the more information. Hum. Meanwhile, we should have let her beat him up. <laughs> I missed a lot of things. <laughs> I missed a lot of things. That's what I. Oh, <laughs> anyway, no, that will be a good ending. The yeah. Kujisake on the um, arc will be the second arc, and we'll see what will happen to you, Murata uh on the next session. <laughs> Godwin, that's not thing, We'll he's see. just an old man. He's just, he's just, we'll just like to enjoy life. Okay? He's a pension, guys. He's a pension. Ada si orang ini lagi lagi pensiunan dia tu, lagi senang senang jalan jalan dia. Arjuna Godwin jadi ini kah? Jadi orang lewat doang. Tahu nggak di kau jadi ini? 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 He lost his oh job and he god. becomes a, a mad doctor somehow. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, well, okay. By the way, the CGDCT is not exactly unintentional, but I didn't know it will work so well. <laughs> <laughs> what is CGDCT? I was, I was extremely worried that it will be like awkward. <laughs> because you know, the character, the personality. <laughs> but mm -hmm. like, oh, thank god, Kuraku. It's the occult club. Where should we? Where, where should she be awkward about occult? It's a perfect yeah. place for GDCT. I'm so. waiting for the moment. I'm waiting for the moment where where Fred and uh, and Kurako finally realize each other that wait, we talk online. You know? Yeah, I know, right? that that will that ever happen? <laughs> will that ever happen? I don't know. Actually, that happens like, a lot with like online friends. You know. That that yeah. thing that principal scene in the beginning, I was like expecting Godwin suddenly like, do you hear that Godwin or something? I don't know Godwin. And, ah, yeah. <laughs> yes. I, I still, I, it's, it's still yes. It's, it's still in my mind. How did the friend? How did the principal? You know, how did the principal interested in occult things? And, and I think the principal is you know? part of like uh, the occult organization, something, something. Ah, I, I think. See. Uh, Oh, no, the, the end answer, happened. Oh. The answer is like, you don't know. Yeah, that's ah, the I see, I see now. Yeah, I see, I see. So the M hasn't uh, hasn't explained about this. Before, no, Kurako's uh, not brave enough to ask yeah. stuff mm -hmm. to the principal. Okay, okay, okay. 
<laughs> that's yeah, the, the surprise I have. Yeah, today. Krakow, uh, no one knows. You guys, none of you knows. <laughs> none of you know. <laughs> like, as yeah. players or as viewers, but yeah. Uh, yeah. Guys, yeah, chat, have... that's the price I have to pay for coming late. I know that. I'm glad you have fun, but you, you also need some rest. You need some rest. You need some rest. Oh my god, I really, I really wanted to continue like the whole session. Uh, but yeah. Um, it's okay. No, we, we probably rest you guys well. will converge in the next session, but we'll see. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. Can't wait next for the first session. club activity. Let's rest well so that in the next session, you know, we can play for a little bit longer. Mm. Yeah. Um, yeah. We, could, we could play like until tomorrow. <laughs> oh my yeah. god. Yeah. Uh, I don't know, maybe like a. a, uh, a, 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 a uh, our stream. The, 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 <laughs> next, the next session is probably uh, at uh, on the on February the 3rd, but I need to confirm it to, uh, with everyone else first. Um, oh, right. Let's not do that on stream. <laughs> mm -hmm. So yeah, but um, we'll see. Anyway, everyone, uh, thank you guys for coming. Hey. Thank you guys for uh, thank you everyone for playing. You guys are amazing as usual. Uh, and... I just do vendors in my shop too. Huh? Yeah. I just do vendors in my shop. I'm just doing basic questionnaire. <laughs> I came late. Your name, Am your I still age, <laughs> I I just make, watch you know. well. <laughs> uh, and just follow the light. I'm I'm still uh, <laughs> a little bit not used to like the whole scene thing because like kind of like, sometimes I feel like it's kind of unfair for like players. Uh, mm. But you know, it's a campaign, so I guess I don't yeah, exactly know. Okay. Like, uh, like, we're not on scene. We could get like a lot of information yes. that is of course need ah. to be separate. Okay, this is what yeah, yeah, my, my yeah. character know, and this is what my character know. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, can't it's wait like, to see. Can't wait it's to like see the watching revelation. anime and starring it at the same time. <laughs> yeah. It's actually good, you know, for things to get you know, to get revealed slow, slow, uh, slowly, like one by one. It's oh, exciting. Yeah. Anyway. Everything builds up to something, which is good. Mm. Yeah. Yes. You're a good GM. Oh, You're a good oh. DM. General and manager. Good DMs. General <laughs> manager. Oh, no, DM's <laughs> oh, 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 oh. It's not the end. It's not dungeon master. Good DMs yeah. deserve good rest. Yes. yes. Good DMs yes. go to sleep. Right there. Yeah. Anyway, uh, thank you guys for um going to He's avoiding okay. the rest. Yes, I'm avoiding the rest. Um, don't forget <laughs> to subscribe to these amazing players. Laila, Stromeria, Zia, Cornelia, Hiwanela, Fiora, um. Narahara Maung, Takarajiman, and Rai Galilei. Hey. And Reza Van Luna! And Reza Van Luna! Now, yeah, um, have a nice rest, everyone. Have a nice weekend. Oh, yes, I'm in Azai. Hot Skareja! Hot Skareja!